The home to the Rough Riders, home to the Regina Pats in the distance. That's our home, the Brandt Center, and our feature, a couple veterans. Brad Gushu, game 250 of his Briar career this morning. And for Jamie Cooey, game 164, that is our feature. Come on inside the building. Glad you're with us on this Monday morning. Brian Mudrick, Joanne Courtney, Kathy Goche. A new week and some new conditions for the Rocks as head ice technician Greg Wasco texturing the stones last night so the players know and maybe some more curl on the ice going forward. In the meantime, action from last night, the number one team in Canada, number two team in the world, Brendan Botcher, cruising early here, Joanne. Yeah, they're looking so comfortable out there, getting a good read on the ice early. They control the majority of this game. Ontario had some chances to make some doubles for multiple scores, not able to connect. This was actually Brendan Botcher's first and only draw of the game, really strong from Alberta. He was the winner in the Calgary bubble in 22. 21. Brendan Botcher representing Alberta and a nice start to win over Scott Howard, Ontario. Kathy, last night a lot of people from Northern Ontario watching this one intently. Well, this was a battle of the undefeated so far coming into this game. It was back and forth. Both teams converting, forced the extra end, and this is a shot Brad Jacobs had for the win. Representing Northern Ontario for so many years. Nice little tap now in Manitoba colors. And they are perfect thus far. The Briar Champ from Edmonton 2013 and Team Carruthers 9-8 the final there. You saw the highlights, Botcher 8-2 over Howard and Ontario. Kevin Schneider, who's from Regina. Nice to see him get a win 7-2 and Scoffin 11-7 over New Brunswick and Grattan. So the standings, it's early. Top three each pool qualify for the playoffs. Botcher, Carruthers, McEwen. Oh, what a start for him in Saskatchewan Colors. And Slichinski, all perfect to start. And we focus on Pool B this morning. Great memories for Brad Gushu in this building. Last time in Regina, 2018, he was the champion. But Joe, sometimes even a five-time Briar champ has some struggles with the ice. Yeah, and for Brad, he'll say it himself. He's the most nervous for that first draw in these championships because he has to figure everything out. He's usually more comfortable as the week goes on, but it's the fourth draw now for this team, and I don't see him comfortable yet. Still having a hard time figuring out where to put the broom and getting a manage on draw speeds. They need to get that communication ironed out to have a good game today. So he told me he's had three games and he's felt the ice three different times, totally different. So trying to find his groove. In the meantime, Kathy, a lot of brother connections at this year's Briar, including the Kennedys. Mark playing well for Botcher and Glenn off to a strong start as well. Well, it's interesting when you hear Kennedy and Cooey, you think about Kevin and Mark, but in fact, it is Jamie Cooey who is playing so well. And this is why he is being helped by Glenn. He is 88%, a plus two. Mark Nichols is even. That could be the difference in today's game. The last time Jamie Cooey started two and one was 2012 and that year he made the three four page playoff game and played his brother lost the game but what a start we're all set first rock next from Regina you have to play really well just to get through your pools and for us to win we're gonna have to play well we're gonna have to beat some incredibly good teams and teams that have been playing well this year and it's gonna be a challenge we have the same team as we have the last couple of years, so that's going to help. But uh, you really got to just get hot at the right time. You got to peak at the right time. We match up pretty well in our pool, we think. So it's just a matter of peaking and being mentally and physically ready to go. Thank you. 
The 2024 Montana's Briar is proudly presented by Montana's Barbecue and Bar, Canada's home for barbecue. By PointsBet, the official sports gaming partner of Curling Canada. By New Holland, proud sponsor of Curling Canada. And by BKT Tires, growing together. Welcome back to the Brand Center. Great to be with you on this Monday morning. Kathy, what do you have your eye on? Well, beyond the feature sheet, Matt Manuel, that is such a good team, but just struggling to get a win against Aaron Sluchinski, coming in undefeated, hoping to continue that trend. Shane Latimer from Nunavut takes on Tyler Smith. He has not played that many games yet, has split those. And Julien Tremblay from Quebec, well, looking to continue trying to get to the even, takes on Kevin Cooey in a must-win situation for Cooey. Kevin, one and two. Jamie, two and one, our feature. And it's time to meet the teams. Brought to you by Home Hardware. Here is how we begin with Team Canada. And Brad Gushu, your skip. Third, Mark Nichols. At second, EJ Harnden. And at lead, Jeff Walker. Out of the Yellowknife Curling Club. Northwest Territories, your skip, Jamie Cooey. At third, Glenn Kennedy. Second, Cole Parsons. And at lead, Shadrach McLeod. So a great start for Jamie Cooey as this is the brother off to a two and one start. Rock colors this morning, it is Team Northwest Territories, the Yellowstones, Team Canada, the Redstones. I like it when a plan comes together like that. You see the draw to the button numbers, not a strong morning this morning for the team from the north. So it is Team Canada with Hammer. And to lead things off, it is the lead, Shadrach McLeod, the 30-year-old who lives in Yellowknife. Slides a bit tight. I've a bit tight. Yep, yep, clean, you know, clean, we've clean. mentioned off the top that the rocks have been textured, so yep, expecting yep, to yep. see some extra finish. Definitely caught the Northwest oh, Territories team here, right? in that draw oh, for tight. Hammer. Oh, oh. Really tight. I took a peek, Joe, on draw to the buttons and Grab watching it. Brad Gushu throw oh, an intern in practice. They had the broom just outside of the 12, and it curled right up near that Montana's button. So a lot of curl this morning after the Rock texturing Lines from tight. the Lines tight, guys. chief ice Top technician, eight. Gregor Wasco. Lines tight. Mine's okay. Top eight. Mine's good. I think Lines in general tight. the players will be thrilled with that. Top the four. speed Hard. has been wonderful. Yeah, the 15 Lines second four. range, high 14 He's from hog to down. hog, but just missing a little bit of finish, especially on those finesse like weight taps. So they'll be happy yeah. to see Can more bite to these stones. Good. Get it out there, pal. Close, just fine. It is third Briar appearance for McLeod. Top eight. Hard then. Top Still eight. Hard. Hard everything. Hard everything. Hard. Keep going. Close. Hard guys. Hard. Hard. Top four. Hard. Hard. Straight, straight, straight. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's see. Good job, bud. There's Back. a good look at that curl, Joe. It will finish strong, and it has it's so far this down. morning. Yeah. And well managed by the brushers. Yeah. A little more curl means it's going to be a little bit slower. So that rock is going to move more sideways than it was before. We did really well to get that rock there. Top four. Hey. Mine's good. good. Top me. Yep. Hard. Yep. Hard for line. Hard. Gotta go for weight too. Hard. Hard. <laughs> Hard guys. Hard. Hard. Really good. Really good go. guys. Really good. Go. Stay on. Roll in. Roll in. Roll in. Okay. Okay. That's that looked slow. like more? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's slow. That's that's my rock. Okay. I, I thought it was a little more. Yeah. It looked like the same or more. Just a discussion from Mark and Jeff. Control. Control. Sometimes there's some mismatched rocks in a set, and often teams will give it to the lead. So Mark felt that in practice his rock was running a bit slower. And Jeff now confirming that after throwing one back four yep, yep, to yep, come yep, up yep, 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 yep. tight guard, that's a pretty big real difference. Hard. Real hard, real hard, real hard. Really hard real to hard. get rid of it. Hard, 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 hard. Oh boy. Nicole Parsons, hard little right tap, right tap, right tap right the right yellow right knocked right in and enough speed to get the red to go. Okay. <clears throat> Just uh, back 12. See more curl on the stones. So seeing Where more curl already on the hits as well. Just an overcurl there for Cole. 14-1 on his draw. 
Yeah, he is. That incredible Olympic run with Brad Jacobs and two-time Briar champ E.J. Harden winning yeah, with Jacobs Edmonds in 2013 four, and Rocky. last year with Gushu 2023. Rocky. That Over. win in London where the team went 10 and we one on route to the championship. I was hoping to get to the nose here yeah, and release the back red well, 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 to plan B. Okay. Keys to the game, and Joe, let's start with the team from the north. Yeah, as mentioned, with the extra finish on these rocks, Team North West Territories has to be prepared for that. They wouldn't see that kind of finish in the regular curling club, don't play in the arena very often. And keep calm and Kui on. Team Kui, especially Jamie Kui, he's looking comfortable out there. He's looking dialed in. Maintain that calm demeanor, and he's going to need one of his best games here against Team Canada. Hard, bud. Hold it, hold it. Hold it. Hard, hard, hard. Real hard. Holy, watch the roll. Wow. Tough miss splitting the uprights. And Joe, the keys this morning for Team Ross. Canada. Yeah, for Brad Gushu and company, they'll want to set it up early. We mentioned off the top that Glenn and Jamie have been playing really well, so they'll want to put some pressure on the front end for Team Northwest Territories. An early read, especially with the change in the stones. This team needs to communicate, sort out what the ice is doing in order to play better as the game goes on. Keys to the game brought to you by Scotty's Facial Tissue. Unleash the Scotties. Looks good. Top four. Close. Yep. Hard play. Hard jab. Make it. Hard play. Hard jab. You got it. Push, Jeff. Top four. Hard. You got it. Push, Jeff. Top eight. We're good. We're good. We're good. Hard. Whoa, whoa. You're right. You're right. Wait on me. We're okay. Top four. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Good shot. Really good. good shot. Well, Joe, you can feel the intensity. Yeah. They've brought it with them this morning. Those two good throws shot. are night and day. <laughs> that one was close. I would set a little straight. First one is rock outside of the line. started to make a move. It looked like it was And Kathy, here's the player you think that could make the difference this morning in Glenn Kennedy. Well, he has played so well yeah, this yeah. week, Mighty. His Heart. numbers are really Heart. good, and he has really supported Heart. Jamie. And when he Heart. has not made the Heart. shot, he's left a really Heart. good miss. Kennedy runs it back, gets the one red, oh, yeah, and he'll roll. spill it through. Shooter yeah. rolls in. That's good. There's no backing it up right now. <laughs> no, but you held it there pretty good, actually. Okay. Sweet. I think we got to go there. Seeing sure. lots yeah. of curl on all the shots, the hits, the draws. That precision will take a few shots to zero in on now with the, the new conditions. And I'm certainly seeing that on the other three sheets. We're seeing uncharacteristic wrecks on guards and rollouts as the teams try to adjust to the new finish on these stones. So, Joe, when you find out last night all the teams knew the rocks being textured as a world-class sweeper like you were, how does that change things for you, a front-end player? Uh, Earlier, so the, the conditions, it was very straight, very fast. If you swept anything early, it would really change the trajectory of the stone. So when you hear that the rocks are getting textured, you kind of expect to have to approach managing the stone differently. You could sweep hard early, knowing it'll always come back. Also know the rock won't carry as much as before. So more aggressive sweeping. You kind of think going to bed last night, okay, we'll be sweeping lots tomorrow. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yep. Half court. Yep. Whoa, 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 whoa. Good shot. Really good. Mark yeah, Nichols, and right now, Team right. Canada lying the three that's with Hammer here in one. It's another inch. These are the precision hits that can be so tough in a circumstance like this. You want to hit this absolutely perfect. Try to make the run double here for Glenn Kennedy. Yep. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 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 And his third whoa. consecutive whoa. Briar appearance. Whoa. All with Cooey. Hard. Glenn Kennedy, run it back. One, Boy. two, great run back double. Shot, Gets some both. That is a big Everybody. shot from the Northwest Territories third. There we go. It's better. Good shot. Thanks. Here. You see more weight. I'd assume a straighter throw, a little more ice. This is good, Pat. This is a good path. That result. You good think this path. is a good path? There's been some draws down here, yeah. yeah okay. You want a little more? You throw a normal? Yeah. That's good. Wouldn't mind seeing just a shade more. Yeah. You like that? Yeah. He 
is a five-time Briar champ in their relationship with Brad Gushu going back many, many years. And these two guys are one, two all time and Briar wins. Gushu number one, Nichols number two. Good shot. The hit, little roll, and again, Team Canada lies to here in one. Good shot. Thanks. Uh, good shot. Thanks. Right on the five. Yep. A little flop towards the middle there, so Mine Jamie Cooley is going right to take eight. on the good double here. Good shot. You won't Let's be able to keep two. your shooter. Yeah. Right. Good Joe, just strategy, good could you not hit this one and try roll to a better place to set up the double on your second stone? Yeah, you could. They could play the hit and roll to the left-hand side of the screen, try to cross the center line and group them. Also might get a miss on broom placement. Could always have to worry about that jam if you're Brad Gushu, but this isn't wrong either. Got a crack at it. Yep. 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 In his 17th Briar oh. appearance, oh. Jamie oh. Cooey. Chat. His first and one, the tough double. Okay. And he'll hit and stick. <laughs> like, I don't know what the guy's got, but. Okay. Mark said he thought his weight was hard. I thought yeah. he threw it hard, yeah. Okay. Thought he was probably about an eight, eight and a half. So. Okay. That's really important information for Brad. He called for a normal weight hit, but he knows that Mark's ran a little straighter because it had a bit more weight. Similar. Good way, a little big. Same weight. Whoa. Five Whoa. Clean. championships, Clean. Yep. all yep. as skip. Yep. Looking for number six here Fire. in Regina. Yep, 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 yep. Brad Gushu hit, Thanks. stick, and again, Canada lies too. Good. Uh, good. The only thing is, I think if he makes that, he might catch onto his own Y2 on us. Yeah. There you go. That little catcher, that yellow. Like Alright, pitch a good one. Jamie's got some great memories in this province. 2018 in Regina, a 4-4 four and four record. 2012 Saskatoon, that's what we talked about up the top of the show. He was 7-6 and six that year. He started 2-1, and one, made the 3-4 page playoff game, and in 2006 in Regina, a 6-5 and five record. Cooey, can he make it this time? Second chance, one, he'll drive it by. And it will be the draw for two here for Gushu, Team Canada. Uh, cool. Good try, JK. Yeah, Chuck, good throw. Yesterday and, and earlier in this event, any kind of sweeping on those peel weight hits would back the rock up significantly. So that's Jamie throwing it to the previous conditions, just can't quite back it up anymore. That slid pretty well. Kathy, it's got to be nice, this situation. You get a free look at a draw as well and a draw for two here in the first end. Well, it is a great opportunity for Brad and, and for his brushers as well to see how quickly the rocks will pick and die with the extra sharpening should be there. Yeah, should be there. last night. I think we're back for choosing it's, the outturn draw here, Kathy. And it's not a precise draw. For Brad, back it eight. will be. He Are will be looking to try to get right to the back pin. Eight. Yeah, you're on this one. Right to it. Just 13, freezing it. 13 6. Yeah. So here at 13-6, and that'll settle back four, and that's two. We're off and running. Montana's Briar, our feature on this Monday morning from Regina. 2-0, Team Canada.
Lead Stones on the way in our feature and a look at Jeff Walker, the Canadian World Junior Champ back in 2006 and five Briar titles, all with Gushu. Two on the board for Team Canada in that first end. So here in two, it is the Northwest Territories with Hammer throwing the Yellow Rocks. Your rock's way slower, eh? Right? Look like a bullet. <laughs> it's just like, just gotta adjust. Okay. okay. I thought that was. I, uh, I so Joe, six, we heard that in the first end. That's a particular like stone. Like but foot. six feet more should be pretty good. Yeah. Okay. Like that. Yeah. Okay, you got it. You know the speed now. Yes. As we listen in there, there's definitely a stone, and and you know that feeling. It's always sent down yeah. to the the leader, second player. Yeah, but. So Jeff's just trying to puzzle out how to manage them the best. So he would have thrown the slow one first for the guard. More, and then if it's six like feet it, slow, down. you can throw yep, the yep. same weight and it should whoa, be a draw. Whoa, whoa. But instead, here, that yeah, went forever. Fine, so guys. they're just trying to figure out exactly this. how slow that rock is that he's throwing first. Whoa, whoa. Wait, close. Whoa. You got the old hot foot going there, Cole. Apparently, yeah. Huh? Well, if you have a stone that. like that, is it easier to identify and maybe use it? Okay, we're going to throw a hit here or appeal. Let's let's wait for that stone. Yeah, some teams yeah. will leave it with the second because the second typically will throw more hits. Right. But most teams so will leave it with the lead. They just ha there's a lot less line. rocks in play for their rocks. Easier foot. to manage. Looks you can like use your sweepers, throw it to a window. Yeah, uh, just better to get rid of it early in the end when there's less precision involved. How often did you have to deal with some duds? I mean, it's challenging, right? Or yeah, often, and you know, yeah. like the sets are usually pretty close, but if there's one that's off or if someone has a question about their rock, you always want to get it out of their hands. Yeah. Get uh, this looks best heavy. rocks possible in the back end's hands. Right, then, yeah. It's interesting, we watched Brad Gushu in his second whoa, whoa. game, and he this felt that both of his rocks were curling. Hard. They didn't catch on until about the fourth or fifth Coming end. Down. He ended up okay. keeping them Still for the whole there, game, right. and I was a little curl, bit guys. surprised. By the time they figured out, he just said, okay, we'll take more ice. But ideally, you want to get Brad's rocks okay, the best and running cards. close so, to the rest of the team. We will keep you up to date all morning long. A blank on sheet B. Over on sheet C, it is PEI, a 1 0 advantage. And Team Quebec, 2 0 over Cooey in Alberta. Oh. Well, and in that Whoa. game, Kevin yep. Cooey yep. had the opportunity Girl. to freeze down to a stone Whoa. on his final. Whoa. He was yes. deep. He went to the yes. back yes. of the eight foot, and that allowed Julien Tremblay to draw Whoa. in Good. for the second point, and Shot. he did. Interesting call on our sheet. I think so. Risk of jamming, but. Jamie Cooey has the double corner set up. You like that? Sure. With Canada sliding like deep it. behind the T line, really like he elected to hit and roll off the center line Two guard. Guns, nice and hard. I, watch I like the, the uh, yellow because it's going to be going close to ours. I thought he might have ignored yeah, it and well, just come yeah. around the corner guard situation. With where that rock rolled to now, there's a double available. Yep, yep. Whoa. Yep. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey. Shot. Let up center line. A little tight. Oh wait, really tight. It's actually quite remarkable. We're thinking for speed. 13 and a half still? No, I think like a high 13. 13 9. Pick yeah, it. high 13. Love it. So it is really swingy towards the middle. About six feet of curl. The broom is on the outside of the 12 foot. I'm curious to see how much it curls going to the wing now. Like Cole Parsons, born in Kindersley, Saskatchewan, lives in Yellowknife. As soon as we can. Okay, Len. Top house. Glenn's rock. T Glenn. line now. T line. Glenn. Glenn, Glenn, Glenn. Just Glenn. Glenn, sweep it. Yeah, carve it. Get it hurt, in there. Hurt, 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 well, I sent a text to Greg Owasco because where I'm sitting, all of a sudden, the venting, it is really, yeah, really cold. Point, so and it's hard to it. tell, but all of a sudden, you'll see the flag starting to really move. There's a great example on the it's Canadian fine. flag. So the venting is happening. Greg came over to talk to me and said that they are now running the exhaust yeah, at full out. They are loading outside. Yeah, it's cold outside. So that's some of the draft. But what they realized after the first day is that if they don't keep the venting and the exhaust at full bore, the ice temperature at level 
gets warmer, and that happened in the second day because the building has been full. That's a check mark. But the impact on the ice, he doesn't want it to negate what he has done to the stones. Kathy, minus 21 right now, not including the wind chill outside. And later in the week, it's actually supposed to get up to about three degrees on Friday, Saturday. So swings inside and some weather swings outside as well this week coming up in Regina. Well, and you can see what a challenge that is for a guy like Greg, an ice technician, is he's dealing with trying to counteract what's going on outside and make sure that it doesn't impact on the inside. Any ice maker you talk to, especially in arena conditions, says that ice is a living, breathing thing. There's so many it's factors yep. to consider. Crowd size, humidity, yep. 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 outdoor yep. temperature. Whoa. 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 It's a real art. Yep. 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 Your stories too, Joe, yep. yep. about the purity of the water to make the ice. And if it's not the right yep. water, you're, right. you're behind the eight ball before you start. I played a world championship in Beijing in 2017 and that's exactly what happened there was issues with the water and the first flood everything actually cracked as it was freezing so they ended up flooding what on top that? of it there were cracks no, in the ice you could see underneath the surface the whole tournament that's not good <laughs> uh, she, <laughs> kathy i didn't mean you kathy okay. you're great sheet c update time well you can good see way. that it is the force for shane latimer good way. needs to hit and stick against EJ, two EJ. Second stone is in the 12 foot, so he does not yep. have yep. much room that he can roll to. Yep. Out of the Callaway Curling Club in Nunavut. Good. It is good. Hit, roll, and one. back button for a single. 1 1. As they'll begin play in three. Just yep. normal. Whoa. Looking for the Whoa. hit and roll to the middle. Whoa. Try to group the stones here. It's one, rolls it over. Good. Good. We have one of these waters. Which one's Good rush. Good sweep. You think? Yeah, are you thinking board? I am. Yep. Maybe like even it. the 10. Sure. So we see the broom, it's just on the right-hand side of center. So for a board weight yesterday, you were looking at about hard, four or five inches of ice. I was thinking this direction may not go as hard. Oh, what, what are you throwing, board? Board? Yeah, yeah I think that looks like good ice. Yeah. Oh, it looks like a lot, but it does. But Marks, I thought it looked like lots too, and it still came up. Yeah, so. I know, but I think it's going a little bit more the other way. Okay. Right, here we go. I like that better. A chance to win three straight. Brad Gushu, look back at teams over the years. Randy Furby's team it's nice. won three in a row from Please. 2001 Whoa. to 2003. Whoa. 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 Clean. Clean. Whoa. Yep. Yep. Yes. Good. Yes. Hard. Roll it a bit. Little roll. Okay, I got it. Points the jam. And Team Canada lies too. 10 2. Yeah. Roll. Good wait. What was it? 10 2. 10 2. Looks like that run curled a bit, eh? Yeah. In the nose, eh? Yeah. Very low. Very low, yeah. Oh, it was a good throw. That great final last year beating Matt Dunstone in London 2023, and then in Lethbridge the year before beat Kevin Cooey. Solid. Clean. Clean. Brother Whoa. Jamie Cooey delivers. His first here in two, looking first. for the first. double and maybe hard. a roll as well. Watch the yellow, watch the yellow. Yep, 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 yep. Gets both yep, moving. Yep, yep. Hurt, cool. hurt. Hurt, 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 hurt. Okay. Still shot stone. Shot. Yeah, they were hoping for the double, but unable to get that. They were calling hard for the role for Cole Parsons, and he was kind of heads up about this it. He wanted to make sure that they harder. stayed shot. Same weight. So force Brad okay. to see a new spot here. More or less, I think I can get away with. So. Yeah. And there is that high guard on the AGI. Yeah, with how much swing 
there is at the end here. These guards really aren't in play for the chase. They're definitely in the thrower's line of vision, but if you rack on any of those guards, you would miss the rock in the house. So expecting to see some nice movement here. 250th game in his 21st Friar appearance for Brad Gushu. Whoa, whoa, EJ, 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 you're good, you're good. Whoa, whoa, for 10-3 on that. Same as what you threw. You know, a lot of people talk in this field about well, Brad Gushu yes. and the Try. success, the five championships, but what Mark stands out in the respect level is how that's competitive, really, how exactly he's dedicated his life to this sport and how he's done it at a high level for such a long time. And, you know, a lot of people, including Brad Jacobs and chatting yeah, with him, that win in St. John's in 2017, it was almost like the relief valve oh, was let waiting. out. Sorry. And you got the first one, you did it at home in front of your home fans and your home province, and then ah, he could just go out, love here. the game, and compete. And man, five titles now in county. Yeah, five titles for anyone is incredible. Yeah. And five titles with the first one in 2017, that's that unbelievable. Bleeding. Don't bleed all over the rock. Just a technical timeout. Nosebleed, it sounds like. It is definitely dry here. Winter time in Regina in the prairies. I think like 13.9 still good, Bill. I think like 13.9 still good. See Cole Parsons. You guys want to throw it without me? I'm not offended, but are you going to be a while? You think? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, the problem with a nosebleed is you go down to sweep and your head's tilted forward. <laughs> you need to have it sorted out before you can start resuming play. Their alternate is good Stephen good Robertson. Good. Just finished sweeping a rock. And not good. <laughs> not doing well. <laughs> yep. Here. Wow. Okay, we'll clean that up. All right, there you go. Let me know. Keep talking to me. Yep. Well, call a lot of hockey games and there's blood on the ice at times. I haven't seen it in a curling rink that often. We actually had one earlier this week, Carl yep. Barton. Okay. And there was blood on the ice and they called a technical timeout and Greg Owasco came out and scraped. So it was in the slide path. And so it, it is dry and it's not unusual. Nice good chat. Oh, my nose is I just can't make a stop, yeah. So out comes Glenn Kennedy, the draw against two here, Jamie Cooey. Nice wait, Jamie. Good throw. And the skipper goes easy on the sweepers. That'll stop in time for a single. Okay. Yeah, that's right. Oh, I would have heard about it. And a 2-1 advantage here at the Montana's Briar in Regina.
Welcome back to Regina Brand Center, feature Team Canada 2-1 lead over the Northwest Territories and Jamie Cooey. Sure. A bit of a delay as Cole Parsons, unfortunately, a nosebleed, stepped aside, appears to be okay and back on the ice, and we're back underway. And lead stones for Team Canada from Jeff Walker. Yep. 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 Wait, good. Yep. Whoa. And Brian, I did Whoa. talk to the head official about Hurt. what the re-entry rule would be. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, and he did confirm that if the alternate were to enter the game for the Northwest Territories, then the player that comes out cannot re-enter until the next game. But they certainly can play with three if his nosebleed gets worse, and then he could step out, but he could re-enter. But as soon as you put the alternate in, the player in question is out. Thank you, Kathy. The chief umpire this week is Brett Waldroff. Yep, yep, yep. Hard, 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 hard. Whoa, whoa! Whoa! Clean! Whoa, Glenn! A lot of weight, eh? Shot. Good. Kathy, right back to you. Update time, Alberta and Quebec. Well, that red stone that is shot at the back, that was the final stone by Julien Tremblay after Kevin Cooey attempted a double but didn't quite make it, but did leave himself shot. And so to get two, Kevin has to come down to that stone and tap it back a couple of inches. That is shade less. That would give him two. Four Briar titles for Clean. Kevin Cooey. Whoa! Curl! Clean! Easy! An incredible Curl. run, always seems Hard to find three. his game. Three. Hasn't really found it yet. He's. Hard. Made eight finals Turn in his career at the Briar. Go, 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 go. Hard, go, 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 Trying go, go, to move go. it and tap it, and that is a nice cooey like shot. 2-2 two, two after two. Our sheet. Shadrach McLeod went two top 12 in his first. The call was a guard. He slid on the ring, so Brad Gushu played the hit and rolled away to the wing. Oh, Nose hit was made by Northwest Territories, and straight, guys. Straight, straight. then the corner guard was called. That's the delayed corner play you see sometimes with the five rock though. rule now. Good spot. Good, good spot. Yeah, you can get there. Alberta, a 1 nothing this lead over same path as your Team Nova Scotia, and 1 1 on sheet C, and you just saw the update. 2 2. Quebec and Alberta. And in that Alberta Nova Scotia game, Aaron Slachinski trying to blank stuck it. And so not exactly what he was hoping for. Got there. Yeah. T. T back four. Yeah. T. Whoa, 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 whoa. T line. T. Whoa, a lot of room. Top four. Always marks. It's all there. Top four now. T. Get some curl here, Mark. Sliding really good. Back four. Hurt! Make room whoa, for two. Whoa, 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 whoa. Shoot. Is it getting keen or are we just overthrowing? It's getting keen. Oh, like it's almost four and a half. Four. 14 and a like, half now. Yeah. Okay. I think it's there, Shaq. Oh, I think it's, no, it's there. not heavy. It's not heavy. Rope, rope. Top eight, top eight. Saw so a few rocks coming up light to start the game with the stones having more curl, but ice is getting worked in now. Back four was a 14 2. Things is getting up to nice speed here. Top eight. Gotta go. Keep going. Gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go for curl, too. Keep going. Keep going. Spot. Let's keep the updates rolling. Kathy over on Sheetsy. Well, that stone that you see buried is yeah. Tyler Smith I, I already jump. lying I one. A little less because we can kind of go into the side of the yellow. Share, shade less. I mean, if we hit the guard, we're fucking going off the sheet. So. 20? <laughs> It, it, it has been a challenge on, on the sheets. Not only where does the broom go, but any soft release is really catching teams today. I like it. Line's good. No Fully. one Line's is under good. curling. Now the soft release Line's was good. a weapon no until today. Yes. No backing. Line's good. It's always going to be at Tyler Smith in his big. fourth Briar appearance. He was Line's two good. and six 
as the Super PEI fun. skip last year in Good London. Call, And that'll stop. Back four, two, two on the board. And a 3 1 lead over Nunavut after three. Three, we're three, we're three. Oh, whoa, whoa. 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 Good. Shoot. Get it. Okay. Sure. And he probably has hit it. It's staying like a third or a little less. Okay. Close to a quarter, I think it's close. What's that? The quarter looks really close. You looking for here? Yeah, you can give me a little extra if you want. Okay. What's the weight? Peel. Okay. Looking to peel the guard here, it slid so tight to the rings that Mark's gonna take on this double. Pretty thin, if he can stick a shooter in the whoa, side 12 foot. DJ. Whoa, whoa, yeah, EJ, It'll be scary EJ, for Northwest EJ. Territories to ignore that. EJ, go, 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 go. Good. One, two, oh, oh, oh. and look at the shooter spills okay, in, back four. Okay. Good. Well, ah, good shot. Shoot. But a uh, pretty bang bang double, bang, like double lined up. Yeah, I'm hoping for a little bit more curling to just Three, stick thin. it right there. Up and use mine. Jeff, This could actually have a little bit of action and go red, red and come up a little bit behind that corner. Ninety percent yep. great yep. numbers to oh. Kathy's point oh. off the top of the yep. broadcast. Whoa. Glenn Whoa. Kennedy. Whoa. And he will not move it enough. Sorry, Glenn. Shoot, it should have been carbon. Just a little fool out there. No panic out of the hand. Shoot. Ah. That's probably the best. Yeah. As they break the sheet in here, the hits here, in particular here. aren't curling as much as they were in the first end or two. Normal. Okay. I threw the out is all. <laughs> it was. Yeah, do you like normal? I do. Yeah. Say it was your most positive yeah. release, yeah. but it was you were pretty darn close yeah. to okay. Lots of chatter this you morning for Team Canada. Is that? I said hard out of my hand, so that's why I was wondering if I was tight. Oh no, but where you stood up, I didn't know if you thought we needed more in the hack or. No, I was wondering about wh what weight, weight I wanted oh, to throw. Okay. I was just. Yeah. We'll try to roll away over there. It's a good sign, though, isn't it, Joe? You, I hear you guys all the time say communication, know what's going on, chat about the paths, yeah. the stones, etc. Yeah, and you sure. often yeah. see a lot of teams in the in the pre-shot portion discussing how yeah, it's going to run, what speed you need. But the most important part, in my opinion, especially when there's changes in conditions, is that after part. So debriefing the shot. Did I give you what you wanted? Was the weight close? Did it run how we expected? Then you can check that box Joel. and Joel. Wait, wait. learn and, yep. and move yep. forward, yep. Yep. really yep. getting a handle on what the ice is doing. Whoa, whoa, Teams whoa, that solve the whoa, puzzle first check. usually win. And a okay. little flip over. Good try. Good wait. Ended up being good control. That's the one I threw last. Time. Sure. Okay. A similar line to yours would be good, eh? Updates continue. Yeah. Alberta Schlichinski taking on Nova Scotia and Matthew Emanuel settles into the hack, Kathy. Well, he has an opportunity okay. for two, Just but a great left. shot by Aaron Slachinski facing three. He made the double, almost made the triple, moved it over, Keep but didn't down, move close. it far enough. And so it is one for Nova Scotia, looking for full eight for the second point. Great start for Aaron Slachinski, as team out of the one, Airdrie one, Curling Club. Had to beat Kevin Cooey twice Room. in Line's that provincial good. run Line's good. Line's to good. win Alberta and then beat Cooey as well. 
There goes. Uh, his there opener goes. back Lines on game. Friday here at the Briar and Regina. Two. Line the tee. Shot, Matt. And Matthew with a nice draw there out of the Halifax Curling Club in Nova Scotia. 2 1 after three. Good job, guys. Good end. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. That's a good shot. Good sweep. Good weight. Double there. Right. No? That's bigger. Slash. It's the same piece, eh? Like here? He's kind of had this same yeah. shot, Kathy, a couple times this Anything morning. A tough Butter slash third. double. Let's go, Not Bugs. easy. All right. Yeah, let's make this here. It's nice that we just got to see it, because Jamie's trapped there, too. Pretty good. Okay, you got it. But it just stayed on that side of the line for a little yeah. bit longer than Or, or we just play hack at it and take the uh, series, but. I like being able to control it a little yeah. bit more. Like it didn't look like it flew through the rings. It was an 11. I had 10 9. Okay, so it's what like, we were looking for. Yeah. yeah. Would be a heck of a shot. His final yep. stone, yep. Jamie Cooey here yep. in three. Yep. Hurt. 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 Tough Hurt. angle. Hurt. Can he get them both? Whoa. Gets one, gets two, yeah. what a shot. Nice Lined it up and nailed it perfectly. Just a normal day. Shot. Shot. That That's has been his week so far. Three. Has made some really, really oh, big shots there. when he's needed to. <laughs> Get that yeah. out of here. Nice, Chuck. <laughs> Threw it so good, just try to miss it. Miss it with sweeping. <laughs> The smile of a guy with a two and one record coming in and a nice shot here on this Monday morning. So the blank on the board, Brad Gushu will just slot a path of ice and fire it down. A two one lead for Team Canada in our feature here in Regina.
Mosaic Stadium in the distance, the Brandt Center in front of us, some great sports memories in this building over the years. The great Connor Bedard recently starring in the Western Hockey League, but curling, my goodness, center stage in this building for a number of wonderful events, including 1982 Colleen Jones, the Scotties final, her first ever championship inside this building in Regina. We saw her coaching in Calgary at the Scotties. She is a fan this time. The six-time champ is cheering on her son, who is Luke Saunders, competing for Nova Scotia. It's always great to see Colleen and Kathy, someone I know you have a lot of respect for, such a competitor back in the day. Oh, she was such a great competitor. And Colleen was somebody that you kind of flew under the radar. She played a very defensive game, and so you didn't really think that much about it until you looked at the scoreboard and realized that you were losing and there was no way to get back in. Just such a feisty competitor and love, love, love the game and was surrounded by some great talent. Kim Kelly, Marianne Arsenault, and so many other greats. Joe, who did you idolize coming up, Colleen? Oh, who did you watch? Colleen was one of them. I remember yeah. watching the Scotties as a kid and just loving her intensity. She was so dialed in. <laughs> Anytime she was on the ice, and it just got me so fired up about the game. Wait, good. Yep. A great double takeout on that last Whoa. end from Jamie Cooey in our hard, feature. Hard. So a blank in three here in four. It is Team Canada Hammer up by one, throwing oh. the red rocks, and really light, eh? yeah, that will wreck on the yellow. And a tough one for Cole Parsons. Right back to you, Kathy. Quebec in Alberta. And lots of trouble for Team Cooey. On Kevin's first, he came short. It's almost on that outturned side. You cannot take enough ice. And he came light, and so the wraparound was made to lie too. And then Cooey's final stone did cut ball. down one Quebec no stone, but already lying two in the forefoot needs full eight or a little bit better for three. Julian Tremblay curling over 90% this morning in this game. Has to stop, curl up a little bit more, and it does both. So, a three on the board and a 5-2 advantage after three for Team Quebec. He's certainly capitalizing on his opportunities. Our line would have been good. Kathy, what are you seeing out of Kevin Cooey so far this week? Yeah. You know, yesterday against Saskatchewan, it was a great game. They played 91% as a team, and that's what you would expect from Team Cooey. Mike made the right shot at the right time in the last end to win that game. But the other games, it has been spotty play. Some really good shots, not so good shots. It has been a bit of a roller coaster, which honestly mimics the year that they've had. They've won great events, and they've not qualified. Yep. Cole Parsons, yep. take hard, two for hard, him hard, here hard, in four. Hard, hard, hard. And he'll get Shot two goal. red. Shooter spills out. Was pretty close to the triple. And it is still shot zone in the 12 foot there for Team Canada. Speed, like pass speed. Same. So a couple feet less. It's fine. Okay. Just missing the rock on the side, on the right-hand side there. Better than it was, but Canada is going to split the rings now, try to get maximum separation yep. between their stones. Want them to be even. High in the house, you'll see the territories play a big hit and roll to try to group the stones. You saw that graphic EJ passing our buddy, Russ Howard, when it comes to games. I'm not convinced. Stop, Rock. Oh. And an unforced error there. there for EJ. Yep. Very good. Which turn do you like? Here, yeah. Keep going. Whoa! Right up, right up, right up! Yep. Whoa, whoa, whoa! 
Go, JK, go. And that red Good. will spill out. Good. And the shooter sticks around. Perfect. We talk about so many great memories in this building, and Eric Sylvain certainly has them as well. You'll remember that great run in team. Jean Michel Menard back in 2006, well, victorious as well. And Eric, a big part of that championship, the final, versus Glenn Howard, who's back here with his son. Unfortunately, this year, Glenn's knee just not feeling well to play, but back then it was all Quebec, and what a championship, and what a feeling. And yeah, there you go. Thumbs up, Eric Sylvain. Well done, my friend. I don't think you ever get tired of seeing the footage of you winning a championship like the Briar. Top four, top, top eight. Felt really good. Full eight, guys. Lots of room right now. Whoa, whoa. Top four. Brings a smile to any competitor's face. Oh, it needs a curl. Place to see. Go, top 12. Wait. It's like go. tight. Oh, whoa, whoa, go. whoa, whoa, whoa. We're staggering yeah, him. We're just guys. short. What happened with Did he get wide wide ice? Or? No, he's no. coming off. So memory lane, this building, pretty special. We showed you Colleen Jones. We showed you that 2006 championship. We mentioned Brad Gushu, the Briar here, 2018. Last time we were in Regina, Jeff Stoughton, a world championship here as well. And the great Ed Wernick back in 1983, the world's there. So some amazing names. Kathy and a lot of those players in your era as well. You see Jennifer Jones, Scotty's 2008. No, it is a tremendous list, but it also reminds you about how great this building has been for players to come into it. It's always five, well three, supported. Three. The fans five, love five, the yeah. sport five. and they know the sport. And so Six. you hear Where clapping go. throughout Top the building, even if it's not your Top own five. team, they recognize Top great five. shot Top making. Five. And Top as a player, five. that's five. all you ask. Top button. Top button. And it speaks oh. to the fan base here. Oh. Yes. They oh. love oh. curling oh. in this province. Oh. They love it in Regina. Oh. And if you saw some of the snow yeah. blizzards we've had the last couple of days and people, that's not keeping them away. It has been awesome. I'm going for I'm going for line the whole way. Yeah. Yeah. Once that gets going, it's yeah. It's Sorry. Pinch tight on me. Yeah. So much curl in that spot. Glenn Kennedy was oh, yeah. playing to come around the staggered center line guards. They came had around everything. Kind of poked feet. out the other side. So just yeah. the speed. Okay. You think the weight just came out of it, yeah, or yeah, like it seemed to just come out of the curl? Okay. Yeah. Give us eight more. Okay. Mark was significantly light on his first there, came up a guard. Just trying to guess, does he need to throw extra weight? Was it the rock? Was it the path? We don't need to sweep it then. Whoa. Back four. We, yeah, it's right Line's beside not, it. Line's not good. Just around it. Whoa. We got to stay Trying, it. it's trying. Shit. Okay. okay. Oh, man. Hey, Mark. It's tough to get out. That's probably the shot, hey? Yeah, I just hit to be here. Leave yep. a soft double to yep. six two or something. What weight do you like? Is it just a good hack? Just roll it right to the, right to here. Hack? Do you think that's controllable with hack? Or do you rather just throw like board or something to make sure? I think it'll be fun. Okay, like let's go, bud. I won't be soft on you. Okay. Can I'm just this in? confirming yeah. the weight choice, asking if Jamie wanted to throw a little more than hack weight. Throw it a little harder, you can maintain that line a bit better, but softer right, weight, you'll for sure get that finish. He wants Those to hit and roll under here. Three. Could play the, yeah, the straight there. draw, just bite the top of the button, get fully undercover, put a lot of pressure on Team Canada, but Jamie hasn't thrown many draws today. He's been all about the hits. Just hack. Okay, I'm out there. Oh, it's okay. Not hack. heavy. Hack. Whoa. Shut. Not heavy. Easy. Shut. Still not heavy. <laughs> Easy. Pull, pull. Harder, harder. Pull, roll it, roll it. Big roll, big roll. Little tap, little roll. Shit. Nice shot. Freedom, Jamie freedom, Cooey freedom, freedom, freedom. has made a few beauties Shoot. in this game. Shoot. Wait, 
Looks like they might just be over that pinhole. Yeah. He's had a couple nice ones. The key like shot is really brought to you by BKT Tires, growing together. Yeah, for Jamie Cui, he had a few double opportunities early this game, didn't quite connect, but made no mistake here. Super accurate, catches that one on the way by, sets up the blank end for Team Canada. It was a nice shot and a smile. <laughs> From the 46-year-old making his 17th appearance this year, the Montana's Briar on TSN. Those precise doubles, lots of space between the rocks. They're hard, and you don't connect there. All of a sudden, you give up two if your team in Northwest Territories, and you're down three. Keeps this game within reach. Whoa, whoa. Really? Whoa, 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 whoa. Now, Frat go soon. trying whoa. to find the Come top forward. of the button go here. T-Light. Got a curl. Oh, needs a curl, EJ. You go. You gotta go. Mine's go getting better. Wait, has got T. Still needs a curl. curl. T-Line. Curl. Needs a curl. Top Keep button. Going. Keep going. Gotta go. 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 Okay. Good sleep, guys. Yeah. I'm going to defer to the that, young Mark? eyes, Joe. I think it's yellow on the yeah. pinhole, correct? Yeah. Yellow shot stone here. Was it? 14-7. Yeah. Cannot believe he did Straight not call on me and my glasses. That's called respect, Kathy. I was it's just called respect. <laughs> yeah, Jamie Cooey's rock is on the is pinhole. Would have had there? to play a little Not tap really. to sit shot there if you tough were Brad. Tough for three. Sure, it'd be really tough for three to crotch that. Still pretty flat actually too, right? It's pretty flat. There. Yeah. Well, if you can, got a whip, it's right here, right? Well, I think you're either guarding his one, like if you're. If you go there, he's just touching it, right? Number one. I think you're either guarding that or you're kicking this away. Yeah. Does he have, there's no quiet run for more than two, is there? That one's not going very Across far. The face? Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. Okay. Like control weight on the nose? Let's go here. Yeah. Anywhere in here? Yeah. You're talking about how the in-off yeah. is available well, I mean, for Brad makes, Gushu. Makes like that back line. My friend Russ Howard tells me okay. hitting rocks right in between in the middle there here, hey? is very, very difficult. Yeah. So I like this call. I like to take that double like yeah, yellow over the top of the redway. Agreed. You're sitting one right now. Just guard against yeah, that. Also. I have to throw it really hard too, to get action on both those yellows oh, in the back. Okay. Back button, back four. Get behind that red a little bit, guys. Okay. Don't goose this. Probably 15 with sweep, eh? Yeah. 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 Yeah, this spot's running really nice now. I think I'm turned, yeah. I think it, the intern will come off too dead for me. Yeah. So. Gotta go a bit. Just four. Oh, no. Mine's okay. Just four. Yeah. You can go. Okay, wait on me. Wait Stop on me. Stop 12. Stop 12. Oh. Mine's good. It's real light. Where is it? Just Where it. Where is it? Just it. Okay. <laughs> yep, yep. What's that ridge? Hard, hard, hard. hard. Good. That was a job. That was good communication too. You heard where is it? You heard real light, and then you heard just in, and that's exactly where they dragged it for their skipper. Yeah, that weight revision is so important as you come down the sheet of ice. Yeah. Two thirds. No rotation. Yeah. Well, I heave it with rotation, like yeah. it's. I think I gotta be like sub six to have a chance at it, but. Sub six, so referring to less than six seconds six from hog to hog. And you'll be in the ballpark. It's fairly flat, so it has to hit quite a bit of the rock on the side, on the right hand side. This would be one of the shots of the Briar. Yeah. Yeah. Big weight, final stone in four. Whoa, whoa. Is throwing a rocket, but man, that curled up big time. And the steal of one. It's been a great start and a great game for Jamie Cooey, locked up at two with Team Canada.
Lead Stones for the team out of the Yellowknife Curling Club, Shadrach McLeod. Born in London, Ontario, lives in Yellowknife. And a steal of one for Jamie Cooey as Brad Gushu could not make that tough in off. So play underway here in five in a 2 2 tie. Team Canada, Red Rocks with Hammer. That's fine. Sorry, Chad. Good angle. Not sure I can with this. Not sure I can with this one. Switch it up. Wow. What's rock? What's rock of yours, EJ? Uh, four, six. I don't even know if I can. Brad's looking for the chase on this rock line. top eight. Think you want yeah, back. Back, back line. You know if I chip the guard and roll on, it's yep. obviously good. Exactly. Back 12. You don't got to throw yeah, too much more, throw. Jeff. Yeah. Like, you don't have to throw too much right. more. It's interesting, Jeff Walker telling Brad with the, the rock he has, he didn't think he'd be able to make that chase. So Brad said, change your rock. So now Jeff has passed that rock up to EJ. Rolled on, rolled on, rolled on. Uh, there's no way to make it, so. Uh, a little light. Yeah, it's light. Update time again as we check in on Cooey and Tremblay. Lots of rocks in play this end. Kevin tried a big weight double on his first, got one. And so Quebec hit to lie two. This Eight. leaves the slash, trying to hit oh, it sideways, yeah. remove both oh. reds for yes. two. Hard. Kark hard, Martin hard, on hard, the hard. brush. And he'll it, pick that over, yes. Kathy. Was it enough? It was enough. The graze oh, over two, was two. enough to score two. Perfect. Yep. Two. Two it is. Good enough. C'est bon. It is Team Quebec. A 5-4 advantage with Hammer after Glenn, four. Hurt, Glenn, hurt, hurt, hurt. And the Team Canada stones disappear. In our feature. Lucky. Hard, hard, hard. Real hard. A little quiet work. Quiet, Brad. Go. Oh, we might have caught that one. Piece of it, Jeff. Hard. Come on, Jeff. EJ knew right out of his hand. Hard. They had to hammer this all the way down hard. to try get a piece well, we'll and get enough of it. Yeah, he knew it early. Just yeah. a little soft release out of the hand. Not able to hold it now with the rocks being papered. Edge on edge, oh, tuck 12. the corner. If it, are we trying to get it in 12 foot or just? Top eight. Yeah, top eight. Okay. 15. Top eight, top eight. Yeah. That's good. Top eight. It's nice speed, 15 seconds from hog to hog. That draw right, weight there. is I got there too, nice good and shot. fast. I don't think it's heavy. Right there, guys. Start right, the cool. game. It was Wait, a little bit good. slower, it's kind of in that low 14 range. And a little light. Each second is usually about six feet. You gotta go. So Keep 14, going, if that's go for a tight guard here. just through, then 15 is kind of T line. <laughs> Hard shot. <laughs> Hard shot. Keep it straight. We're Keep in. Straight. We're in. Keep it straight. Keep it straight. Good spot. Shot, bud. Three. Nice throw. Four to Good. Good weight. Whoa. Hard. Whoa, whoa. Jeff, go the other way. Go the other way. Roll it right. Keep going. Pretty sure. Another update, Kathy Nunavut, PEI. Well, Shane Latimer hit and rolled on his final stone. There's been a lot of looks at the stone on the tee line and the one at the back. And Tyler Smith went back and forth and has decided that he'll play the hit and Roll try more. to stick for the guaranteed one and Roll then take a clean. look. Yep. Yep. No. Tyler playing with Adam Cox, Chris Gallant, Ed White, and Paul Fleming here clean. as their coach this year. 
So they would one. take a look, they would measure, and it would be two for PEI. Thank you, Kathy, and a 5-2 lead over on Sheet C. Five, seven. 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 If I'm drawing, I'm gonna throw a seven. Sure. Yeah, I don't mind it, whatever. That's half a rock. Whatever you like. You like this? It's be a little wider in the draw pass, so it's gonna be that's that speed that's up the middle, at like five feet slower. Two okay. options here. There's a double so available. Nice but it's like good kick. Long. Yeah, you gotta be nice and positive to hold okay. the line. Okay. Yeah. So Team Canada opting give you the same to utilize these staggered one. guards. That was back second four. one. Yeah. So you like that? Part. Okay. Yeah. You can see how far out the broom is. It's outside the 12 foot by about six inches. So be a little bit of a guess on what the draw speed is here. Mark has some room to work with. Wants to be about the T line, but just needs to be a piece of the equipment to be shot. Back four. Sliding good. We're back eight. It's coming down a little. Uh, still heavy. Looks close to through. It. Okay, Mark. They just haven't right. been sharp. Yeah, and I think that one was just a, a, a guessed wrong situation. The sweepers didn't yell back 12 out of his hand. Update time, and we can see the house as Aaron Slichinski settles into the liver. Well, he throws big weight really Hart. well, trying to play the Hart. double Hart. after Hart. Matt Manuel froze Hart. to his shot stone. Hart. Gets one across and across the top. On red. And a steal yeah. of one. Nova Scotia up 3-1 after five. Just five. Oh, we talk about the Felt brother there. connections in Mark Kennedy and Glenn Kennedy. If you talk to Mark growing up, Glenn was the better athlete and the better curler. And as a youngster who's a really good soccer player, had a terrible knee injury playing soccer. And then back in 1999, he was actually supposed to skip Mark's team at Provincials. And one of those replaceable hacks, well, it flew out while he was pushing out of a hack to throw a stone, re-injured his knee. So back in the day, Glenn was an outstanding curler. You could just take Mark's word for it. And you know, life gets in the way, injuries, family, job. But what an athlete and competitor, Glenn Kennedy. You like that? Yeah. Yeah, and obviously with the brotherly connection, knowing a lot of what it takes to win, Glenn and his wife Susie actually run the junior program out of the Ellerslie Curling Club in Edmonton, and I got to hang out with them for an afternoon about a month ago, and just really interesting talking to Glenn. He, he knows so much about how important the fundamentals are, and he brings a lot of knowledge to this team. Jeff Mark Nichols, one, got two, a nice double. Well, the follow up on the story of Glenn as well. So he's got three girls, you mentioned Julia. She's 15, she just won U15 Provincials last year and gold for Alberta at the Winter Games. And his other daughter, Mackenzie, just won bronze at the U15 Provincials in Lacombe, Alberta yesterday. So the Kennedy family, very strong when it comes to the brothers good, and hey? the young women curlers coming Look up. Good, a pretty less. cool story of that family. I'll give you less. Great double made by Mark Nichols. His draw was heavy, but it did hang on. So as much as Jamie Koo would love to ignore this red rock on the side of the 12 foot, just come around the center line. It's too risky. You don't want to give up a three here. Big, yep. clean. Yeah. Heavy, whoa, whoa, whoa. just control, whoa. just Try control. Try for a long whoa. roll. Clean, yep, yep, whoa. clean. Hard. Whoa. Clean, 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 clean. Clean swine. Good throw. Good. Good touch. Okay. Kathy, you've done the updates all Briar Long in watching Jamie Cooey and his team. 
I mean, what has stood out to you so far? You talked about Glenn and his play and, and the pluses at third, but what stood out to you about the way this team is playing this year? I think it's uh, Jamie's demeanor. He's always been very laid back, but he's very determined. And I know that he's taken a new job uh, as a COO of a company that it means a lot to him and he's working really hard at it to be a role model and I don't know if it's all feeding into that but he is playing Please. with just Please. so much Please. more maturity yep. and poise yep. than we've seen in the Art. past yes. and the outcome go, he just Art, parks Jeff. it if it really doesn't go, work Jeff. well Art. it's just a whole Art. different Jamie down, and Jamie's oh, always yeah, had a lot of talent go, 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 go. Sit. and Brad Stone will roll all right. A little bit too far. I think it is shot stone for now. Is that a little light? I don't think so. 10 8? I don't think so. I didn't no? get it. Okay. Did you get it? 10 8. A little light, eh? Shade light, yeah. Yeah, I was surprised it curled that much. I thought I threw it good, but a little light. Precise little shot here, though, for Jamie Cooey. He wants to be right on the nose. Same way, Chad. There hasn't been as many tits over here, I don't think. Hair more! Yep. Whoa! Whoa! Clean! Clean! Same! Yep. Hard! Yep. Same way! Hard! Hard! Clean! Whoa! Clean! 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 It's got to be close, on and off. Boy. And a yeah. nose hit. And there's the force, so a job hey well done from this team out of the Northwest Territories. And it will be a draw for a single for Brad Bushu. Yes, Ended up being similar by the time it got down here. Similar weight-wise. <laughs> I just wasn't seeing as many hits out there. Yeah, no, I'm glad right? you popped it a little bit. Yeah. Kind of where everybody's been throwing this pass. Yeah. Brad Gushu, seven finals all time in his career, winning the five times London 2023, Lethbridge the year before, Kingston 2020, here in Regina 2018, and the first one at home, St. John's. Back in 2017, final right. stone here in five. We picked this up and right out of his hand. Wow! Coming out. It has been that kind of morning for Team Canada. A steal of two, and they have not looked settled. They have not looked comfortable. And full credit to Team Cooey, up by two after five. We'll step aside from Regina. The 2024 Montana's Briar is proudly presented by Montana's Barbecue and Bar, Canada's home for barbecue. By Home Hardware, here's how. By Scotty's Facial Tissue, unleash the Scotties. And by New Holland, proud sponsor of Curling Canada.
It is the sixth time the city of Regina hosting the Briar. The men's worlds this year in Switzerland beginning March 30th and one of these teams will qualify and represent Team Canada on the world stage. In the meantime, it is our feature this afternoon and it is time for our numbers after five. Yeah, the story so far today being the steals for Team Kui out of Northwest Territories made a beautiful hit and roll to the back of the button in four and a really shocking miss from Brad Gushu just now in the fifth then comes up light of the rings for that two steal. Story here, Kui playing well at 88% and Brad just with some uncharacteristic misses. After five is brought to you by PointsBet, the official sports gaming partner of Curling Canada. <laughs> Two and one record, great start for the Northwest Territories and the team from Yellowknife. We'll step aside, final five next. Maybe now when it's all gone and everyone says you're so wrong, you're throwing your life oh. But you say, yeah, it's time to show it all the way to so long to every time that you say it all Today's gonna be your day Yes! Today's gonna be your day And how do you like that? Draw eight, pool A. That's later on today at three Eastern time. What a start, Brendan Botcher, three and zero record. And Trevor Bonneau has really turned heads. He's been so impressive. Two and one record. That loss last night to Carruthers in an extra end. Your updated standings: Botcher, Carruthers, McEwen, Slachinski right now all undefeated. Top three will qualify from each side. Remember, there's no tiebreaker game, so. The head-to-head -head matchups are so critical. So for Bono, for Botcher, if Bono can win that one, you know what, you bring yourself right, right back into three. things and you just want to keep right on three. rolling. Right, okay. Our Eight feature, points. sixth end. And you don't see that from Get Brad Gushu very often, it whether it was a pick or the release or something, Joe. It was a steal of two for Jamie Cooey and play underway here in six. Yeah, you saw sweepers pick that drop right out of Brad's hand, but it barely made it over the hog line. You have to think that yeah. maybe it grabs something. We talked about it off the top with Team Canada just not quite puzzling it out out there. There's been misses up the lineup that have been uncharacteristic like ball four players. Never thought it was heavy. Top eight biting the four. A little bit of room. Read to it. Read to it. Okay. Mine looks Mine's good. good. Yep. Yeah. 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 Mine's good. You see the two stones, Shadrach McLeod, one on the button, and that.
tight guard. As Jeff Walker delivering his second here in six. And a good drag right up to the button frozen. All right, Kathy, so it's a busy morning, and get us up to date across the sheets of ice here at the Brand Center. Well, Joe, you just used the word puzzled. I think we can put that right across all of the sheets. Jamie making some big shots when needed. Matt Manuel has read the ice really well. That has been the difference in that game. Suchinski's upweight ability has got him out of trouble, but not completely. In the Nunavut game, he's got draw weight, but Tyler Smith is really in the groove, and the Quebec team capitalizing on misses. Whoa. Team Cooey has little been little chasing. Little These are skips straight, that you would straight, expect straight, would really straight, be comfortable straight, with the ice. Brad Gushu, Kevin Cooey, they are the ones that are really confused. Kevin in danger of dropping to three losses already. So lots to continue to keep you up to date on here at the Montana's Briar here in Regina. You know what seems to be the biggest Steve. confusion on the three well sheets then, that I'm watching well is not okay. the draws, they're curling Good. hard, and not the hits, the in-between weights. Some Steve. are running straight, Whoa. Whoa. some are curling. Whoa. Those are the off. biggest, Whoa. most consistent Whoa. misses Whoa. Curl, that I am curl. seeing. Ah, oh, we're too heavy. That's the worst spot. <laughs> okay. You heard Brad say it, that's the worst spot. It bounces off into the open, nose hit, both these reds are gone. Let's go. Yep, whoa, yep, yep. whoa! Oh, oh. Set! Go, buddy, go, 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 really hard, really hard, really hard. Cole Parsons, Five. big weight, and he makes them both disappear. Hey. Update one more time. Kathy over on Sheetsy. Well, Tyler Smith made a double on his first to lie three. That is what set him up. And it is two that Shane Latimer is facing, electing to play the hit. Needs to stick. Oh, clean. Yep. Clean. Good. Bang. On the nose. It is PEI, though, in control with Hammer up by two after six. They're hard. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Yeah, keep going, Mark. Keep, keep going. Trying for just a little bump. Move these behind a little. Weight was pretty good, but he's just Wanted to get inside. to nose and just okay. bump that rock top four into the back four area. Oh, boy. Seems like for Team Canada, if they get good. the weight right, the line is off. If the line is right, the weight Mark is knows. off. Just one of those mornings. What do you see? Border here. Here. Good. Love it. Julie. Here, big. Oh, good. Go, no, control. Clean. Control. Yep. Yep. Clean. Where? Hard. Control. Hard. 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 Uh, whoa. Oh. Set. Set. Go on, go on, go on. Okay. Audible, I guess, there. Yeah. Fine. Yeah. That's good. Yeah. Yeah. Blast it into the pile and try to scatter everything. Yeah. You know, two rocks on the button. In turn low. Facing yeah. Team yeah. Canada, so time for a little bit of cleanup yeah. here. That's the last thing you want to be doing, trailing by two. Mark's going to try to run this into the rock and the eight foot. Have it ricochet oh, off and curl, disturb curl. the situation on the button. Curl. Curl. Oh, no. And the straight jam. Okay, Mark. Try it. Okay. Throw. Probably need to audible and go the other way. Yeah. Where are the red? Are you going right. again? I feel like we just throw it in the pocket. Yep. Yeah. That's what we saw. Top 12 even, eh? Top eight, top 12. Yeah, we saw in. Yep. A couple options. This yeah. red. Is coming three. back. If it runs right into Looks the, like the lot, space right? in between the two yellows, the like eight foot nice in the top four one, all those yellows will, will go. So 
they're just going to wrap another one around. You could throw a high guard on that red rock as well. It's another option. Up by two, though. Six. Electing Four, to five. just sit another one. Six. Yep. Top okay, look, easy. Easy. Top Mine's good. Mine's good. Mark Kennedy, the lefty. Top Glenn eight. Kennedy, the right-handed rock good. thrower. Mine's good room. Yep. yep, yep. Just top eight. Hard, hard. Wait. hard. Coming down. Hard wait. Hard wait. <laughs> While that stone hard. lands, hard. 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 Kathy back hard. 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 to sheet B in update time. Whoa. Whoa. Well, Aaron Slachinski oh, faced oh, two oh, stones oh, buried on his oh, first. He tried to run a guard back. He wound up clipping one of the guards and leaving his shooter there. And so the Nova Scotia team wrapped around Mine's again. Good. Faces three, Just needs the butt. I good. don't believe Mine's he can perfect. score because the shot stone would need to be tapped Still back. Running. So Still trying running. to get to a piece of the button to concede one. Still running. Line's good. Put it on the tee. Put it on the tee. Yep. Yep. Hard, hard, hard. Any chance he could yeah. move that enough? No, but a great red. draw weight to yeah. limit Super. the damage to the single. It would have been tough. It would have been ballsy because we had to Nova Scotia, high. Manuel. Three point yeah. advantage back to our feature. A couple Ready. yellows go. It's still that's good. Yeah, yeah. one, two. That's the situation. Line two, Jamie Cooey and company. The Rocky was, drove into the ring, in hung around at the, the top 12, the though. Uh, I think you're rolling over here, aren't you? Control? Yeah, we know this spot good. It's like, well, the center line. It's like a uh, play the run double and he'll roll it. Control? Try to roll it far. Roll far away. Okay, yeah. Like behind the corners, they go oh, okay. over or, or there in the east foot somewhere. Okay. Control? Okay. Control! I got a lot. I got a lot on it. Weight's great! Whoa! Clean! Weight's yeah. perfect! Yep! Hard. Whoa! Hard. Clean! Clean. Whoa! Yep! Hard, 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 hard. Hard! Jimmy Koo with a hit, whoa, 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 the roll whoa, whoa, over. Whoa. Great shot, beauty. Good, beauty. He is Go. on his game this morning. Really nice weight. Nice spot. Line call. It's hard, man. <laughs> Good throw. That was a little heavy. <clears throat> Kicked hard. Yours came up a bit. Yeah. Get it half buried behind that yellow. Yeah. 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 Throw this hard. Got to make the double here, but shooter, you can hit this on the inside and have shooter roll towards the left hand side of the screen. You can get a portion buried. Be a tricky chase for Jamie Cooey with all the curl this morning. Whoa. Whoa. Clean. Whoa. DJ. Curl. DJ. Curl. Hard right, DJ. There's the double. Hit. Shot. Yeah, hit and roll away, and the force is on again. It's just like good board. How much is this buried? Is it just edge on edge? Just hate to give him, hate to leave him some kind of blank. Right? This is a good done to blank, even if you do, right? I'm not too worried about it. True. Yeah. Right? That's true. Yeah, let's play that. Oh, whatever. Just to edge of four. Just a control, I think. Yeah, let's make it really good. Or do you like board? I like control. I like the same weight. I like this call. They talked about rolling to the open side, opting instead to roll to the left hand side of the screen. And try to get the shooter just underneath by a piece or half a rock. You heard Jamie Cooey say. I thought that was big control, wasn't it? Yeah. You know Brad won't solid. risk chasing it and, and wrecking on the top, and you also narrow down the rings for that draw for one. And you got to feel awful, Joe. I mean, listen, Brad Gushu's made a million shots and a million great hey, shots in his career, Same. but Easy. you're coming Same. off a draw Easy. that you missed Easy. earlier. Hard, hard, hard. Easy. Same way. Easy. Clean. Can Jamie Whoa. hit and roll this to a nice Go little straight. spot? Straight. 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 
There is the hit. He'll flip it over. Now the nose hit is available for one. You saw that graphic, 0-6 all-time versus Team Canada for the Northwest Territories, and it has been Jamie Cooey every time versus Team Canada. Nice chuck, though. I wanted to roll that somewhere. <clears throat> One of those ones, yeah. Hard, no, 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 yeah. It's, yeah. it's just, that's clean. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Glenn's calling line. He doesn't want yeah. to roll out of the rings and give away a blank for free, so he was calling it cautiously. Final stone in six. Yes, yes. Trying to pick up a single here. Brad Gushu. Clean, 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 clean. And there it is. Nose hit one of the board. So the hammer goes back to Northwest Territories. Jamie Cooey has the lead as we'll step aside here from Regina at the Montana's Briar. Welcome back to Regina. Hey, Kathy, what's happening? Well, there's a lot of red in that house. <laughs> that is Quebec for Kevin Cooey. It has been a struggle. Last end, tried to pick out a stone, went by, listening in the yeah, mics, similar. just so it's confused similar. by some are curling, some aren't. Weight hold on, hold on. is in between. Fine. This is a hold force. On, Quebec hold hitting on their me. last stone. Yeah. July 2 oh, yep. needs to navigate yep. a port and stop in the All eight right. foot. Whoa, 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 whoa. And that little kiss will help. 
And a single, so it is Quebec. Julian Tremblay, Jean-Michel Arsenault, Jesse Mullen, and Philip Brassard having a great game against the four-time Briar champ. Good, okay. In our feature, what a game so far for the Northwest Territories. You have to give Jamie Cooey and company a lot of credit as the last two ends, the force was on. They stole the two after that rock picked for Brad in five. And finally, that single in six, they hit versus two. So here in seven, it is Cooey and company, the Yellow Stones with Hammer and a one-point lead. It's not good. nice. You need a lot of curl here, Jeff. Never Top comfortable four. against a team Go, like Jeff. Team Canada, We're though. Miss, yeah. You know, at Go some hard, point, Jeff. they're going to puzzle it out, hard, out hard. here. String together hard, a few shots going. in a row. Keep going. Keep going. Hard, Good setup yeah. to keep start going. for them with hard. two center line guards. Keep going. Hard. 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 Okay. Gotta get his body coming at the broom a little bit better. It's all release right now. Good wait. It's all release. Three quarters is perfect. Yeah, make, make it sure, the ice, make it the low side. Make sure of this. Three quarters, bud. This is high, right, bud? Sorry, you said low. Inside yeah, no, high. just yeah, the, the double low. Yeah. yeah. Three quarter rock. Oh, yeah, yeah, hard, Whoa. hard, hard, hard. Whoa! Whoa. Yard, hard, hard, three. Come on. Oh. And you felt they had that. Shoot. And there's the jam and a break for Team Canada. Yeah, just a mis miscommunication on, on the line call ah. there. Oh, it's terrible. And one chance to navigate that hole. If they don't, they're in trouble, right? True. Yeah. Similar way, eh? Same yeah, way. Yeah, you could probably throw a seam. You saw the graphic. That 2017 Briar, that was in Brad Gushu's hometown, St. John's. The last win for Jamie Back Cooey. Four. I got a few more feet, Versus well, Brad Gushu. Yep. So it just goes wait to wait. show you, you can never wait sleep on this team wait. from the north. They play you tough. Whoa, needs a curl. Yeah. Top button. Needs a curl. Needs a curl. Top needs button. A curl. Needs a curl. Needs a curl. Mark, go on this. Go on this. Get as far as you can. Go, 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 go. Right. Keep going. Keep going. Right. Keep going. That's right. pretty good. Okay. Good wait. Either that or this. Now that yep. yellow stagger, Joe's not yep. helping them. Yeah, all kinds of trouble that. here for Jamie Cooey and company. Yep. I like that too. It looks like half to me, actually. You can get all three of these guards moving. Angle slash the red over onto the two yellows. Same throw. You got it. Real hard. Hard, 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 hard. 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 Push it out. Hard, 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 hard. hard. Hurt! A little more, a little more, a little more, a little more. Okay. <laughs> Nowhere else to get in there, so. Either you tap it right on the nose or we try and angle tap it in here again. My thought was on the nose. On the nose, because okay. then he hits and rolls That's what I was thinking yeah. as well. Kathy Goche, one more time. Yeah, Please update us on Sheet C. Well, Shane Lenimer made a really nice shot on his first one. He hit and rolled under, but was not able to replicate that on his second. And so it is an open hit, a chance for Tyler Smith to take four and a commanding lead. Coming in with that one and one record. Queen. Chris, Chris, a Chris, Chris. Hard to it, Chris. And the shooter will stick around. <laughs> back 12. So that is a big score in a 9-3 lead. Hello. Try to make that top one a roll under, eh? Like close to nose, yeah. All right. Oh, the spot Trying down to go here. straight back now, Gunner. Yeah. Would you ever, Joe, look at 
you know, a softer weight rearranging the two yellows close to the house and hope you spill them in and open things up, or is it too late in the game now? It's just a little late in the end. Those three reds in the rings are problematic. If there was maybe only one, I definitely would love to rearrange those and get them both counting. For Jamie Cooey, he needs the path to the button here. Long run back, Wait. double Wait. attempt. Wait. Whoa! Yeah. Whoa! Whoa. Yeah. 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 Glenn Kennedy, run it back. Oh. Got one, yeah. got two, got all three moving. And that is another big shot from Glenn Kennedy. And the rock he ran back oh, hangs up. on. All of a sudden, oh, Northwest like Territory sitting two yeah. and three. <laughs> what a shot. When they needed it most, he comes through for his team. <clears throat> Shot gave it two licks, he would have got them all. Yeah. Just kidding, it was great yeah, though. Yeah. Glenn has made some Looks outstanding, like just really precise, big weight hits this game. Yeah, that read pretty true. Yeah. Line's a little Come tight, on. guys. Line's good, EJ. What's up for? Line's okay. good. Wait, no, wait. Line's good. Line's tight. Line's tight. Line's tight. Line's tight. Line's Brad's staying on the board. offensive tight. here. Line's tight. Line's tight. Party Could hit one of those Come biters. Board. Instead, they're going to play the draw here. here. Easy. Whoa, 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 you're there. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. And okay. look at the curl, Joe. Sorry, you know, the difference know. from, like Kathy, you can speak to this. You've been doing the updates from night one Friday and the I'm amount of swoop on that. It's dramatically different, and that's what you would expect. Greg does not want to have to texture the stones again. But there have been struggles, and I'm sure that the teams that are playing in the other pool and are watching this will learn a lot. But the misses, so many this morning as teams try to adjust and figure out where to put the broom. Like you gotta, you gotta be like here, try to roll to here. It's not right. on those yellows. I think we just follow it. How do you just go? Yeah. Let's follow him. You got a time on that? That? Time on that? No? It was like a 14-6, I think. Okay. Let's check in on Sheet B as Aaron Slichinski settles into the hack. A really nice double by Matt Manuel on his first left, him lying three spread out. And so ignoring it, Aaron Slichinski tried to go around his corner guard on his first came up short, and that allowed Matt Manuel to draw into light four. This is a draw to the oh, yeah. button. One is opener yeah, versus time. Kevin no. Cooey. Remember, well, Kathy yeah. had to Knife really fight Knife. back to beat Nunavut. Yes. To get that Knife. second win. Knife. And in top versus Nova Scotia. Yeah, keep going. Trying to carve this over. Oh boy, has Hard to loops. dig in quick. Has Hard to loops. dig in really quick. And it will stop one, one for red. second one, shot. Yeah, so red. one red stone, a steal, and it's 5-1 for Manuel Nova Scotia. Team Cooey talked Wait. about playing a double on the top yellows. Electing to play the come around. There's some space around the button. The spot is just running really quick now. 14-2. That's almost back 12. So it hangs on for second shot stone. But it is the Team Canada Rock that counts right now in the four. Team Canada has thrown quite a few on this side, this end in particular, with some taps early. That was 14-4. Yeah. Yeah. Mark said his was 15-1. That's it. It's about a 15. Yeah. 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 Try and get a light in the button. How often you see that the team that's protecting, trying to open things up all end, throwing hits, just not quite dialed into the speed. Big opportunity here for Brad Gushu to get two undercover. So adjusting here, Joe, to this path, you know it's slick. And I think you got your stopwatch out. Right there, Mark. And he's got the horses to do the work for him. Great sweeping between Walker and Harnden. Line's good. All you guys, top four. 15-2. Real good. 15-2. Line's good. So what does 15-2 get you? Well, it gets you. Right to the face of your own stone, right near that button to lie to. I'd rather be on him than bounce right off. Yeah. 
And to be fair, Joe, that 15-2 was really with some casual sweeping. It's not like they hammered that at all. No. Holy smokes. That is fast, yeah. I had 15-2. Yep. Kind of kick it hard. Keep one. T line. Top four. Kathy, how different are the releases from Brad Gushu yeah. and Jamie Cooey? Well, they're dramatically different. It's e it's even how they come out. So one is very square. Idea, Jamie right? sort of okay. comes out at a tilt, but he has worked out his here, method guys. to yeah. the broom very well so he can ice himself. But no, it's very no, difficult for off, one skip off. to read off yeah, the yeah, other. Right on the corner. Yeah. Love it. This shot is all weight. I got T. Needs to get root, root, root. shot stone it's here. Good. good chunk right. of the button. Right. Just six. Line's good. Line's good. Need to go a bit. Go a bit. Line's good. Line's good. Line's good. Yeah. Line's really good. Gotta go. Where is it, boys? Yeah, right it. Get it here. <laughs> Keep going. So you saw Brad's draw. It wasn't really whoa, whoa, whoa. a sweeping whoa, shot. Girl. He didn't drag it a lot. This one, little Great shot. shot right? That's shot, shot stone, nice I throw. think, Joe. That little nudge. It's really good. good yeah. shot. It's close. I think it might be red. It is close. Mark Nichols oh, looks it over. Shot, I bet a good amount sure of money it's still. Okay. Yep. Wolf coming off of that. Bounce off. Yeah. Patch. <laughs> still a great effort here. Well, what else do you so 15 5. I guess we could a little bounce. take it away if we threw a guard. Make the draw tougher as well. Yeah. Yeah, and he's going to try to come through the hole with. Or, yeah. Yeah. Or it's hit and roll two rocks. Or we. Hit and roll. Right. Yeah. I even just rolled it right here. Right. Who's shot right now? Brad thinks it's us. I think it's us. Yeah, he just plays this for one, but. What's that? Yeah, underneath it probably does look. I said like then it. he just plays it like ours for one. Or if we it, try and get the right here. Yep. You ever touch the yellow? It's... Yeah. Then it's yeah. He's, he's tapping yeah. it for two. If you think it's us, then I probably don't like that shot. Just in case we do touch the yellow. If we get to there. That makes the in off tough. But then he's got to tap tap. Is the in off ever f for more than one though? Like. Well, yeah. If he hits it here. Yeah, if he, probably. If he gets, yeah, if he gets it a little low here, yeah. it could. This could spring up just a little bit. Yeah. Right on the eye, right? Just how do you get there, Mark? That's such a tough shot. It's Jeff's it's probably path, my right? corner line. Okay. Isn't that your guard path? Like yeah, like basically there. it's right on the A, right? So. So well thought out guard. by Team Gushu yeah. there. Try to take both away. He is the in off for two, so if you, we might be shot. That's why we don't want to draw and then right. nudge it. Right. We're not sure. Can we like tap tap on one of these guys? You can be over Absolutely this perfect to yeah. play this in off for two. But well thought out. Guard the shot for two. Yeah, you don't need to really guard the yellow, just path. What do you want to see, yeah, Brad? Just guard the inside. Right. Of is that going to get over there, Jeff? For high, I like that a little better. Yeah. Okay. Brad was What's tempted to play here? the out turn wide and come around everything like, to go back not button. not as quick as the path we just played, okay. but it's close to 15. Two rocks to come here in seven. Still not quite sure who is Shotstone. Looks good. Here at the comment that Team Canada like, thinks guys. they are. Hard guys. Hard guys, hard! And a big push hard just to get this across yeah. the line. Out hard, comes go, Mark yeah, Nichols hard. to get it hard, across go, the go, hog go, line. Go, go, go. Uh, great sweep, boys. And great just sweep. enough. It's real good. It's good. Nice sweep from boys. Really good. Line. Yeah. Just a fantastic sweep. Man. 
Shade to the 2017 line, yeah. final where Mark ran out to help sweep that in for the win and he had to come out as well. well this is veteran helping on the sweep too. Watch, Mark's going to run up and he's sweeping on the way up. They know they need every single inch here. Great sweep, boys. Great sweep. Real good. It's good. Nice sweep from boys. It's really good. Yeah. Like how I heated up that uh, six feet. <laughs> there you six go. feet before the hot line. <laughs> I saw it. Joe noticed. It. She was all over it. Yeah, pretty hard, right? You're Love it. Yellow hard. I think I'll throw it like a back. But we're just trying to make sure one. Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't really see anything yeah. else. Yeah. Come into it. Unless hit three straight in there, but. Yeah. I agree. Same kind of throw. Just two feet more weight, eh? Yeah. This is two inches less. Just try to hair that. Yeah. Try to hair this guy. Yeah. Just hit the holes good. Had shakes, PEI and Nunavut. And a win for Tyler Smith. 10 3 the final over yeah, Team Nunavut. Hey, buddy. Good luck. Hey, buddy. Good luck. Good luck. Thanks. Okay. I love this shot. This is what this is yeah. the call. You, you want to throw it then? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so what are we doing here in our feature, Joe? Is it through that port and try to tap the yellow a little bit, or is it the draw? Try, try make a good one. Trying to tap this yellow up, I believe. Okay. Navigate that port. It's really hard to, to stay wide enough with the way it finishes to get to the side of the button for your one. So just trying to jiggle this oh. about Clean. an inch Clean. to get Clean. shot. Whoa. Score your one. Ten. Clean. Whoa. Shot. Shot. Yeah. Whoa. Hard. Still ten. Whoa. Whoa. Clean, clean, cool, cool. Final stone in seven. Check. Right oh. through the port go, they go, got go, through. Go, 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 go. Cool. Hard, 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 and now carve it over. Hard, hard, hard. No roll, no roll. A little tap. Okay. And the shooter okay. across. And is it good enough for one? Still close, eh? I think so. I think that should have done it. Huh? Yeah, done it. yeah Mark so. says. Thank you, Mark Good Nichols. Really it is one. I wasn't sure what it was before. That was overburied. <laughs> what a shot. <laughs> Jamie Cooey. Having a morning in Regina, and he leads by two.
He has had a number of key shots on this Monday morning. Jamie Cooey, that final stone, a lovely draw to get it across, a little tap to make sure they got their single. So it's a 5-3 advantage, Team Canada, eighth end, with Hammer throwing the Red Rocks. Well, the edge is for Jeff Walker, but as I've said, buddy, in watching this team from the north, they have been consistent in all of their games. Sometimes other players playing better than one position, but the next position picks up. And we're just seeing more of that this morning. Sit, sit, Rock. Okay. Kathy, right back to you for the update on Chiti. Well, it has been a struggle. Kevin Cooey went around a center guard and he's had great weight, but it has been where does the broom go? Came out into the open, not able to tap a Quebec stone back. This is a shot for four. Wow. What have you made out of this young team, Julian Tremblay, out of Quebec oh, so far this week? Yes, yes, really yes, strong, yes. really, really strong. We did not oh, know no, no, no. this team that well, yeah. but they have made a lot of shots, very, very determined. It's really good to see new teams coming out of Quebec and performing very well at this level. Wow, 11-5, and Kevin Cooey in danger of dropping to one and three here in Regina. Yep, 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 yep. So two stones now, top four. Good. Shoot, that carried you further see than that I thought it was going to. Kleenex in the nose. Unfortunately, Cole Parsons a nosebleed earlier in the game, but thankfully he's competing. He's okay, and right now he's out curling. EJ Harnden. Sometimes that gives you extra focus when something happens it's medically, yep. and it's go, we've Mark. talked about it. It's yeah, just Mark, very that. dry in oh, here, Mark. and they're putting so much pressure on the brushes. Hard, hard. It's the winter, it happens. EJ clips both okay. yellows, can't spill them both, but cleans up that top four. Did really well to connect on that. That was a long run back. Good shot. The Northwest Territory is up two without Hammer. Love to look for a bit of defense, but there's three guards in front of the house. Stay on the old fence here, try to get one in the rings. You heard them say, though, it's light, so another guard. And clogging up things up front. Oh, boy. All right, didn't think it was that much less. I wonder, it just curled here. Yeah. Soft, it came off. Soft, maybe. Maybe, maybe. Must have been. Well, he looks good, Mark. Yeah. Top four. Hey, Rube. I don't think he's heavy. Top eight. Real wall yep. in front of the forefoot. With these guards in place, so he's just Don't looking for the come round. Doesn't Top want to be too deep, though. This side of the sheet Line's going okay. away was Jonathan's really Top fast. Button. It was in the low 15 range. Coming home, it looks okay. like it's running just as nice. That's a good two feet deeper than they wanted it. Well, I, every time, you know, they just run down and then they'll curl. They're similar to my eight. Like. Yes. There's... Just a hair light. I got T. Bit of room, bit of room. I think it's to it. Well then. Oh. Top Line's butt. Good. Top butt. Top butt. Perfect. Perfect. Top butt. Line's good. Room. room. Line's good. Top butt. Might have to go a bit. Just to it. Just do it. Mine's good. Easy, easy, easy. Top four. Mine's good. Hard Chat rock. rock. Gotta go everything, guys. You're not even here. That's fine. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay. Sweeper's right, just a just little tentative with that right, one. Sure me. Somewhere in here. Yeah. But, yeah. If you pound that though, Joe, yeah, is that not over curling away, anyways, you think? Or you think they could have locked yeah. it on? Yeah, if they okay. hit it before the break point okay. for, for weight and line, it would have no, delayed I'm that thinking, happening. Thinking like 
Hackers and Kathy, that. there's the numbers okay. and one of your storylines to start I'd this like game. To be aggressive, and if you well, again, like we that, always talk about okay, the brothers right. on this sheet, but it is these brothers that is the focus this morning and some wonderful like shots hack. Yes, all hack. made by Glenn. 11 and a half, tell them. Brad, 11 and a half? Sure. You like that? Clean. Yep. Clean. Just down. Clean. Hair quiet. Hard. Just yep. hard. Hard. Hard, Jeff. Hey, Jeff. Hard, hard, Jeff hard, Walker, hard, hard. the entire way down. My goodness. Uh, not quite what I was expecting. Okay. Good throw. Oh, the weight was pretty close. It wasn't that light. No, no, weight was close. Oh, weight was really close. But if you're, if his is. Yeah, Joe, we heard Brad say not what I was expecting. So clearly they're just not on the same page. Sure. Yeah, I think the spot just surprised him. Just Out of like the here? hand, there was no sure. panic. I don't know. When you see a rock over curl like that, you assume that the skip sees something, has a sweeper sweep it the whole way, but they were just watching it for most of the sheet. We got to run it anyway. Do we want to hit and roll? We could hit and roll, yeah. Got lots of time. Look you at want it. To go look at it. Go look at it. Okay. Should have been down there to start with. I think that's your options. I like both. I kind of like taking. Yeah, we can play that. Way, that or that. I think it's a higher make shot. Yeah, probably higher make. Like if we end up just peeling, really we'll definitely get under the yellow. What does he do? If you clunk yep. the back of it. And then you get the yellow coming back. Uh, probably going that way, right? I don't mind that. I'm just saying, like, we could take a run at this. I'm just saying, if we miss it, what does he do? Well, He's probably chopping and rolling under. Yeah, it depends where it is, right? Let me play this. While they talk things over, Kathy, Matthew Manuel, a strong game this morning versus Team Alberta and Slichinski. Well, so Slichinski made the slash on his first one. That's how he got shot. And on his final stone, Matt Manuel hit and yep. rolled yep. into the mix. Yep. So Hard it line. is redstone surrounding. Oh! For Aaron to Hard. score two, he'll have Hard, to try it. to get Hard, to the go. inside Hard, going, right of the stone it. just rolled Hard. by Matt Manuel right, and it. tap Hard. it back. Keep going. Dylan Webster, Kerr Drummond, Jeremy Hardy, Aaron Slichinski had an Airdrie and yeah. not to be there. So one yellow. they do get the one yellow after a couple of back-to-back -back steals from Nova Scotia. It's 5-2 there after eight. In the meantime, our feature after that conversation, Glenn Kennedy. Almost control. What are they playing Play here, Kathy? Play. Clean, clean. I'm not sure what they decided, Close. to be honest, Whoa. buddy. They're playing clean. a hit and roll Lates off the Close. side yellow. They talked Close. about playing the Close. long Close. run back, but Close. felt that it would Close. just help Close. Team Canada if it was missed. Girl. So they hit oh, off their oh, own, oh, got to oh, roll oh, it over oh. enough and tuck it in. Okay. And it is second really and third try. shot good belonging job. to the Northwest Territories. Oh, they would have rolled another half a rock. Pretty so good. good. Yeah. Runners we guarded, he goes here. I thought, sure, maybe they could even play the there, double okay. off their That's yellow to the red that. and then stick so, it there as well. It was pretty, Option. pretty thin, though. I didn't mind two. the hit and roll. Yeah. Unless you play the red one. Also love oh. the 20-foot run for Glenn that Kennedy. He's made a bunch of them. Jeff. Okay. I like the draw. Yeah. What's up? Draw. Okay. Yeah, with that stagger on the yellows at Not the top of the house. This one. Those are accessible with it the curl now be to be promoted, but the stagger makes it really tough. Kind of here. Yeah, not as quick as that. Yeah. Okay. I'd say four feet slower. That's okay. yeah, I agree. The other one just got real quick. Huh? So many rocks. You know, okay. so this will force Team Canada so to the other side of the sheet. More, the I, give us two feet more than you threw. Okay. Three feet. Northwest Territories played a come around earlier this end and came up significantly light, so assume that Mark will need a little bit more on this one than the other side. Really like Mine's good. Back four, a little Have we seen right a lot of okay. action here this path, Joe? Not a ton. Close, still back four. Well, if we can. You got room. Back button is trying. Close, yep, yep, yes! It's still heavy. Hard, whoa, whoa. Wait's good now. Wow, look at that make its move Hard, just guys, by that go, high go, yellow go, guard go, go, swooping go, go. in. And good. right to the redstone to lie to. What a great draw from Mark Nichols. <laughs> good shot. And just Great for shot. reference, I had a 14 on that Back from hog to hog. Yep, yep, yes. Each second's about six feet, so oh, one side's running oh, at about a 15, and this side's a 14. Really well managed by Team Canada. 
Good discussion in the hack to buy into the speed and really well executed yeah, by Mark Nichols. Sweep it, kind of hold it out there a bit. That went sideways at the end. Anyway, it's got to make it. I think it's two here. Where with that guard is a bit of a liner, right? Yeah, I don't see. I see thin is real thin, like flashing it. I think you can go with all you can see. I think it's there, right? It's really close. I think you're touching both reds. And it's just a matter of whether this six gets where that six goes. Okay. Yep. Firm? Firm. Yep. Let's go, bud. Try to slash this yellow in right in the middle of those two rocks. Prefer this over following him in? That? You prefer this over following him? Yeah. I can't do anything on the follow. He's still going to lie to you. Okay. At least kill one of these reds would be a pretty good result for Jamie Cooey. More, right? It's really hard to hit them perfectly in the middle. Well, not real hard, just peel. These were really floating out yesterday before the paper. Oh. The texturing of the stones Three. that was done Check. by Greg Owasco last night. First here on eight, Jamie Cooey. Oh. Get a piece of his own yellow, and he gets both reds going. Another beauty from Jamie Cooey. Good shot. Incredible. Uh, almost blew a tire. Oh. <laughs> I thought you were going to wick that three. Oh, man. Stop. Stop curling it. Blew a tire. Literally hit right where they called. This just squeaks by the top yellow. And Glenn, a little stick, <laughs> trying to get the sweep out. I don't think it was going, even if he got on it. Without the little trip. What a shot. He has been remarkable this morning for his team and putting a lot of heat on Team Canada. And Brad Gushu. Still a chance here for Brad, though, to get a skips, too. So much curl in this spot. Team on its own right now. You want to be four. Reach not bad. Line's Clean. good. Clean. T line. Wait on okay. we guys. Line's good. Line's perfect. Yep. Top four. Line's good. Top four. Go. Go. 15 one. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Gotta go. Come on. Trying to drag it in for shot stone. And that'll settle. Okay. Top eight still shot rock belonging to Jamie Cooey. 15 one. Thought I threw what you wanted there. I did. I thought it looked good. Just put on the. Yeah, like, do we just go? Kind of see that. Yeah. Player comparisons yeah. brought to you by New Holland, proud sponsor of Curling Canada, and in the 90 percentile, 91 so far for Jamie Cooey. I think so too. But you think I'd run double? Try, yeah. Back four. Where else you go? Like, oh, I know. I know. So long to guard it. I know. I'm just thinking like better off here. No, that's what I'm thinking. Yep. Like, we got to be past it, right? Yep. It'd yep. be nice to be way over here. Yeah, I agree. Then it's jammable, right? Yeah. Lots of ice. Probably give me a gadget eh? 12s. Yeah. Like that's min, I think, hey? Okay? Should be good. Yeah. Kathy Cooey and Tremblay Quebec uh, looks to be a hit for two. It is. Tremblay made a double on his final stone and rolled out. Girl. And that is why there is this opportunity for two needs Please. to get to the nose. Girl. Girl, 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 go, 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 you can do that. It's coming down already. Bottle stone in eight. Jamie Cooey without hammer. They wanted to come in and draw another one here in the house. They'd love to get some separation. Don't want to set up a double here, Joe. And my goodness. 
Is the double there now for three? Can they hold that shooter? Oh, oh yeah. I would imagine there is. Almost three quarters, yeah. There? They were looking to come around back eight Normal? foot around the yeah. rock that was top eight, assuming that Brad would have taken on a run Gain double half. attempt. Yeah. Just light. It's one of the rare times the pro miss was actually heavy. You know, you even if you tick the yellow win and you scooch right out of the house, but now the door is open no. for the five-time okay. Briar champ. Doesn't quite have all that normal. top yellow. Yeah. You like that ice? So can't whip this. Yeah, hit it high. Yeah. yeah. I think you got to be here high. Yeah. That's an option. Huge chance here for three. I like it. Yeah. High in the house. What an opportunity here in eight. Clean. Curl. Whoa. Whoa. Curl. 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 EJ Harden. Whoa. Curl it over. Whoa. Get Whoa. enough. And they overcooked it. Oh. They had it and overcooked it for a steal of one for Jamie Cooey. That was so hard to do. <laughs> Even he can't believe it. Yeah. It's been that kind of morning. Six, three. Lead Stones underway, and this one from Shadrach McLeod as the team out of the Yellowknife Curling Club. That steal in eight, a 6-3 lead. It is Team Canada with Hammer, Red Stones, 
here in nine, but Joe, take us through that final rock last stand thrown by Brad Gushu. Yeah, it was a it was a tricky shot. Needed the just off nose to make that double. Wanted to make sure he kept your shooter for the three points if you're Brad Gushu, so they didn't whip it down the sheet and just came up more than they expected it to it. At no point did they call on for to keep it straight. Came up a little too much and out of nowhere there's a steal. A Four point swing. Easy. Wow. And I think that teams will and are appreciative of the sandpapering of the stones. They wanted more finish, they got more finish, but it is catching so many players and teams already. That's good. You go too high and he just chases it. It's in front top eight. Front ours. Okay. Yeah, the biggest thing when you get that sandpaper is the consistency and how you throw the rock. So if one over curls, I think it's all there. Lots. do you right. take more ice? Do you throw it a little straighter? Sometimes What's you start that? to see this double adjust no, happen. Just, so the okay, skip Glenn. gives just more ice me. and the yeah, thrower throws great. it differently. Oh, and then you miss the other way. And then you move the room again and then you miss the other way. And it's a, a bit of a tornado of misses. And you don't end up inching your way into where you actually need to put the broom and make the shots. Anyway, it's where we it, wasn't it? <laughs> he thought, yeah, Cole even said, he thought it was heavy out of his hands, but yeah. that'll settle. Top eight. Like yeah. that. Yeah, a little difference in speed on the side up. of the sheets right now. The, the right-hand side's running a little slower than the left-hand side. Take Lots of like, rocks uh, came down the left side of the sheet in the seventh end. 11 and a half. We saw it. Saw it, hack. I like that. How much weight? 11 and a half. This way or this way? Whatever you know. No, this way better. You know yeah. the end. A little less than half with this turn. Maybe. Wait, it's good. It's good. Close. Close. Yep. It's good. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. Mark. Curl, curl. Burn. Curl. Burn. Curl. Keep going. Curl, 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 curl. Keep going, keep going. Good wait. Okay. One. Good wait. Okay. <sighs> Whoa! Let's... Little outward motion wow. on release. Okay. Straight, straight. You could tell just that extra out of his hand, Joe, and you could see it right away. Yeah, sometimes add that speed with a little extension, any outward motion just will not come back. Careless, be Plenty there. of leg drive, little extension there, just outward line. See it come back a little closer to the center line. It's so subtle, but it makes a huge difference on the trajectory of the rock. Good, Mark. Top eight. Top, top four. four. Top, top eight. eight. Top eight. Still got something out of it, though. Removes the rock. Top eight. Yep. Wait on late. That was at the top of the 12 foot. Top and eight. They disturbed their yellows, Rips. but I don't Rips. mind that. Gotta go a little. Gotta go. go ahead, Mark. Bigger than Northwest Territories. Top Gives eight, Canada Mark. less to work with in the house. Hard, Mark. Hard. Go, buddy. Hard. Give it to the team. Go, go, go. Good, good, good. Good, good shot. Good shot. Just the one, eh? Yeah. I might be tempted to take on the double peel here, but any kind of miss on the left side of the top rock would be Please. coming right onto the rock in the house. Please. Please. The three-point lead for Northwest Please. Territories. They're happy to just give up two this end and take the hammer coming home. Sometimes you have no choice but to play that higher degree of difficulty, but when you have the option, you keep it a little simple. Yeah. Okay. Here. Okay. Board weight. Yeah. Nice weight. Yep. Yep. 
Gotta go, Jeff. Mark Nichols here again. Gotta go hard. Gotta go really hard, Jeff. Really hard. Hard. No. Uh, and the nose hit, and Good that wait. double Good wait. could be available. So let's look at the results and schedules. We'll look at Team Kui on the right. So who they have left, none of it. Saskatchewan's played really well. Slichinski and PEI. If you can find a way and knock off Team Canada, you put yourself in a real nice spot to try get to be hard, top hard. three. And for Gushu, hard, you hard, see, hard, you still got hard. Alberta Kui, who Whoa. had a tough morning as well. Roll it. And Whoa. Vladimir smith no, 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 no. So, Okay. Yeah, good try. You can really help yourself out here if you're Jamie Kui and company. And hang on here versus Team Canada. It's all right. I'm just thinking our best chance at three is looking at one miss, right? Yeah. Like if we can make the roll here, he hits the open one and then I wrap, we need one miss at that or a miss on the draw and then we get three. I think if we go here, he's got two cracks at this, right? Okay. That's the only thing I'm, I'm throwing out there. My only thought was maybe freezing this right now. Yeah. I don't think it changes his shot though, Jeff. I think he's still gonna try try this. No, but there, try this. There's a chance, better and chance. If we of ever it. if we ever bump it a little bit, then it's kind of around the yeah. horn, right? Oh, I know. Just trying to figure out the best way to get three. Yeah. I uh, personally I think the best way is if we roll over here, he knows this. Okay. Then we wrap, and then either either he tries to split the rings or tries this. Okay. I think yeah. that's the best chance at three. Yeah, I, I think I, this. But uh, getting two, like we're still in the game, right? He splits yeah. there, possibly. You had to throw it, like a little rotation. Like I'd have to throw a, a spinner. Because then I really like the hit and roll if we can. Well, then I like that hit and roll for sure. I like that. Yeah, I, I, think, like so I think you're right, because yeah. even if My he first runs was the roll misses, under, but it's an automatic double. Well, it's or... open up, and then we got a guard. Right, yeah. It's, uh, and then he does, if it's perfect, he does nine, it again. Yeah. I know. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I think he'd I'm make one you. out of two for sure. It's well thought out. Don't want to come under this corner guard now and give Jamie Cooley two cracks at the run back. Same way. It's a perfect way to the last yeah. one. You like this show or what would you be playing? Uh, Jeff mentioned the freeze. I, I like the freeze call. It's it's the hardest degree of difficulty, but it puts the most um, accuracy onto Jamie Cooley and generate a three here. You're going to need some precision. Hard. Yes! Hard. This call plays too, though. Hard. And as Brad hard. said, even two here keeps them in the game. Hard, 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 hard. I think. Right there. Okay, that's fine. And the nose hit. Good wait. Good wait. Good wait. Okay. Or, or thin. No, too thin. Okay. I'm going to miss it if you wrap, right? Yep. Let's go here. Yep, I like that. Roll around. Kathy, I can see Matthew Manuel settling into the hack over on Sheet B. Well, he faced four on the first one. He made a double and left those two stones there. And so is electing by where the broom is to play the hit for the single. If he hits and sticks, he'll out cap that other yellow. Kathy, at first glance, it looked close. It is close, but the other one's buried behind a guard. Yeah. Otherwise, yeah. I think that's the more obvious right. shot to play. He could play the draw. To it! Final stone on the clean, way, taking clean, on clean, clean, Aaron Slichinski out of the ARG clean. Curling Club, Stop. and he will hit roll a little bit, but... Oh, it ooh. might be too far. But... But... <laughs> talk to me, Kathy. <laughs> but I think it's a steal. Actually, oof. <laughs> yeah, maybe not the best slang call there. Jamie Coury in our feature. He'll nose hit to be shot stone. Yeah, I think it's you, but we'll measure. Quick. So they're going to measure on sheet B. It's like a 9-9. Nine, nine. Yeah. yeah. I think it's we will it's update you as soon as they know. We will tell you at home. So Brad Gushu looking for the hit and roll under now. And we'll hope for a miss on the run back. Double attempt from Jamie yeah, Cooley. Looks like it. Yeah. Just kind of stop curling a bit. 
I think I thought so when it's a curl in it. Good way! Looks good. Clean. Yep. And as Brad delivers the measure on sheet B. You heard Luke Saunders from Nova Scotia say maybe not the best line call. He's had the clean at the end and those sharpened rocks, they move. And there's that little flip behind cover for Brad Gushu. Great shot. And it's red. They might. I think they're asking Kathy for one more go around. Tighten it up. And they certainly can do that. If you just go by it, yeah, it's fine. I'm glad I didn't take it back. Yeah, red. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so it is one red and a 6 2 advantage for Nova Scotia handshake. So that's a win for Matthew Manuel. And that is a team that has played really well. They just weren't able to get in the win column until today. In the meantime, it looks like Joe Jamie Cooey lining up a triple. Can he get all three moving? Oh, yep. Kind of connect in the house. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, His final Whoa. stone in nine, Glenn. calling him off. One, two, oh, and he I'm gets good. enough. Good call. That's close. So it will be the draw for two for Team Canada. <laughs> good enough. Just want to connect with one there. It doesn't matter. There's been some head bopping and scratching on our feature sheet of ice this morning. Meatball. Just we missed that actually. Backed off on them. Almost missed the one in the house. I played uh, two wins ago. Final stone in nine and a chance for two. Today, lots, Just guys. needs paint. Top four. Jeff Walker, EJ Harden, ensure it is there. It is. And we have a one point game coming home in 10. Can the Northwest Territories beat Team Canada for the very first time? We'll step aside. 10th end. Next.
Approaching noon local time here in Regina. Welcome back inside the Brandt Center. It is the last draw, and it is also our feature, a 6-5 advantage for Team Northwest Territories with Hammer, throwing the yellow stones, lead stones on the way, and this one coming from Jeff to. Walker. And Joe, what an opportunity here for Jamie Cooey and company. Yeah, no more you can ask for. You have the Hammer, right the one-point lead. Uh, okay. well, it's right next to it. Whoa, just let it dig. Well, no tick rule in play at this year's briar. You can't well, move well, 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 well. a rock that's touching the center line until the sixth rock of the end. Sorry, guys. Okay. Here, the big sigh from Team Canada. You tap the yellow Both on rocks the are on the center line. They're just very close the together. It's a What's relatively that? easy double peel. Really. Okay. Just a little bump. Yeah, freeze the yellow. Tap the yellow. Yeah, I, I just don't want to be over here, right? Because these are no. coming back eventually. Okay. We're through, yeah. That's right That's to fine it. too, yeah. Okay. I got this. Okay. You don't often see this, but Jamie Cui calling to throw this through. He's recognizing they don't need more points to win here. Extra rocks in the house can only help Team Canada. Kath, we always talk plus minus, so a shot like that, does that go against your percentages or do they just throw that one out? They just toss that yeah. out. You don't get any points for chucking a rock. <laughs> you have to have an intent. In theory, you should get five out of five because you made the shot. Called and made. <laughs> no, just uh, it recognizes skill and ability and not your ability to chuck. <laughs> anyway, it's over. Hold on. Pretty close. Canada Whoa. looking for a long Whoa. guard here. Whoa. This can be tricky Finish late game if they get into the Whoa. inner stuff. It can slow down. Just past the green okay, line's good. Line's good. Higher the better, guys. Whoa. Higher the better. Doesn't matter if it's Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, I know, but I doesn't need the curl. Good. Okay, sit. I'm just saying. Good. Tempt them to make the run. Right? Yeah. Like, oh, yeah. there's three guards all touching the line. And now go time for Jamie Cooey. Yeah. Oh. Yep. A little bit. Clean. Clean. Different dynamic, Joe. You've had the opportunity to play on that single sheet of ice, and I know it's still round robin, but you know what? There's decent amount of fans in the building. It's a little bit quieter, and you can feel the intensity here. And what's at stake for both sides? Yeah, I mean, Brad Goosh in particular is very used to that setting. He relishes the spotlight. He'd love being the only sheet out there. The nice thing is you can finally hear each other. Give it a go. Make sure it's cold, though, eh? Yeah. Didn't quite get right in front of the tight guard, so a slight angle. Cole Parsons will take a run at this double peel, but knowing his tolerance, he'd rather miss wide here and just get the one. Remember, he had that extension Whoa. earlier in the game. Shooter, 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 shooter. Heart shooter, heart shooter, heart shooter. all three going. Yeah, that was right. not... Was that the call, Joe? I thought just make sure they peeled, but they got it. They wanted to take a go at it. Yeah, okay. Great shot from Cole Parsons. Good sweeping. Nice throw, bud. Yeah. Really well thrown, just clean the whole way. Four good ones. Shot. And that in good weight, too. You know, he didn't try to get excited or adrenaline and heave that thing. It was a nice shot in the fist pump you see there from Glenn Kennedy. Yeah, throw it harder. <laughs> And now that lone guard is so high, it's really not in play. Anything buried around it is chaseable with the extra finish today. Caleb Flaxy is the coach for Team Canada. Try to draw a T line behind it. Well, that's why I was thinking corner freeze. Yeah. We corner, corner freeze, freeze you can get around it. it and then use that as guard. Looking for there. <laughs> He can't get rid of it. Yeah, he's ripping the guard, he right? He peels yeah. and you go around. 
and you start exactly. Well, then we guard, we guard center. a little bit, yeah. and then we come around. That's my that's, that. that's my the next three right. steps, right? I like the freeze. Version. This is your your my first. first. Yeah, yeah. So we're thinking freeze. You I think if we, if we go there, we're getting further away You're from the button. Away. Here, eventually, I like I can get a good yep. chunk of the button on yep. my last. Yeah. I like that. If we else. execute sure. properly. Yeah. So freeze, he rips, right? He rips, freeze, we he guard, rips, guard. We guard. Yeah. He rips. We just got to be careful. We might have to do it one before he does. He might, right. well, if we throw a guard, he I might think, come there. I think right now we want him trying that. I, don't we? We'll hope for, yeah, this. Like, well, yeah. cross that bridge when we get there. Yeah. Let's, yeah. let's execute like the next, yeah. 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 next three. Talked speed about here. throwing the guard here. Uh, let's but to be buried around the rock this is that's high. Brad's saying you're moving yeah, further and further away from the button. You put the corner freeze on, and you guard that a few times. On Brad's last, you can come around and actually have pretty much full four, even bite the back of the button around the freeze situation. Sorry, say that again, That is a better rock. This is the one that's sliding a little better. Top 12. Bite the eight. Yeah, top the eight. Yeah. Top 12. Okay, line's a little tight, guys. Ahead, okay, play the weight right now. Line's tight, though. We can go a little. We're a little late. Yep. Top 12. Go. Okay, Get we're, we're over curling. Just play go. Whoa, whoa. Keep going. We're just uh, half whoa, in. Whoa, whoa. You gotta let it stop, guys. Tight. We're, yeah, we're whoa, tight now. Whoa, whoa, we're really over curling. Whoa, whoa. Just never got out there. So. Okay. okay. Okay, Mark. Hey, Mark. It's not a, not a bad spot. No. And line got a little tight early, so the sweepers Sorry. couldn't drag that to the depth they wanted. They were looking for anywhere from frozen to top yeah. 12. Is this the only call here, Joe? This is the no-brainer peel? Yeah, it, you, you don't want to come in and, and risk sliding deep, leaving them something to freeze to. All of a sudden, you're shooting against the loss. It's time for the game story, brought to you by Montana's Barbecue and Bar, Canada's home for barbecue. And for this morning, Jamie Kuish has been on fire. He made an outstanding shot in the seventh end to take his one, a come around, over buried, just to jiggle a frozen rock. And in the eighth, just that four point swing out of Gushu, he had a double for three and missed. Both skips numbers are pretty even, but Kui just making those big shots when it counts. That steal of two and five as well. Remember whether it picked or just light for Gushu. That was a big stolen two points for Jamie Kui as he's trying to hang on here and knock off Team Canada for the very first time. I like going around it. Okay, back for it. Same speed? Yeah. It's the same time. Okay, wait over, guys. Top four. Room. A lot of room here. Okay. The line will be okay. Top four. Looks good. T line. Lots of room. Always EJs. Top button. Always EJs. Need it back Top four. four. Line's getting better. Gotta go for wheat. Gotta go to get it Line's back. Hardy. Come on. Hardy, you got it. Come on. Hardy, Top four. Curl, curl, curl. Just curl. freezing, get freezing. Of it. Get it on the corner of it. Sit. Okay. And a little okay. tick. Here we are. Sorry, guys. I always thought it was a little light. What? I always thought it was just a little light. Yeah. I like that throw better. This came down a little more oh than they my. expected it to. They could have got off that, tried to make it curl and just get it more frozen on that top yellow. Glenn's going to take a run at this run back. Hard. Yeah. Hard. Right out of his hand. Glenn Kennedy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Run the red, yeah, clips it, both right. moving. Another Go pistol on. from Kennedy. Good. He's having a game. Good call, pal. Good call. He's just been dialed in today. Oh, boy. First shot. Pistol, bud. Thanks. Line call. Only thing Brad Gushu and company had to work with was that yellow rock, and he spilled it off. Made me sweep though. One side. 
talked about the potential of Glenn being the difference in this game. He was playing so well coming in. And no disrespect to Mark Nichols, but he was a plus two coming in. 93% Kathy on hits for Glenn today. And that, Big numbers. Yeah, that plus, you get a plus when you outcurl your opposition by 5% or more. All right, then. Just pass out. Huge with the back end Go. players. Get all you can out of it. Hard. Hard. Keep going, guys. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Okay, let's get sweet. Like in a different path, or, or was it just? Me, I, thought, I thought you took a little off. Okay. Hang on, I do. Uh, it's either corner freeze or a little hit and roll. Mapping out options. Uh, corner freeze, he just knows it. I think we got to hit and roll. Okay. Not much to work with here for Team Canada. But straight peel has to be made first. Stranger things have happened. Jamie Cooey. Wait. 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 Fine. Playing the peel. And Brad Gushu running out of time and options here in 10. One more. I think it'll still curl here, Mark. Yep. We were talking it through while Jamie Cooley was going to throw. Talked about playing the corner freeze on the rock that's in the 12-foot to sit shot, but then it's just a nose hit for Jamie Cooley, so trying to play the hit and roll. Back, yeah. Same as last end, eh? Jamie yeah. Cooley could either chase it or just, just play the draw, yeah. well, touch the eight foot for the win. What a last mark. If you would have told him that to start this game, that's your two options against Team Canada, he would have jumped like all over it. Right? Yeah. Needs to be the shot stone when this is all said and done. His final rock here in 10 without hammer. Good Down way. by one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. EJ. EJ. Yeah, he's gotta go. Wait, it's good still. Got keep going, EJ. EJ Harden. Carving this over. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Wait. Makes the hit. And now options available. You can just rip it, peel it clean. And you got the victory. Throw it a little, but not enough. Take your time. Yeah, I think if this had been partially under cover, you wouldn't see the chase out of Jamie Cooey, but it's wide open. You think back to his sister, Carrie Galusha, back in 2009 at those Scotties in Victoria, knocking off Team Canada. And now another team from the North for the first time ever. The Northwest Territories 0-6 all-time versus Team Canada make this go away, and Jamie Cooey will knock off the defending champs and improve to three and one at this year's Briar. This is a huge moment. Jamie Cooey stepped onto the backboards twice before he settled in the hack. Routine shot, but what a moment for him. He settles in, delivers. Final stone in 10, make it go away. And for the first yeah. time ever, Jamie Cooey, the Northwest Territories knock off Team Canada. Now he has played so well all week. His team and Glenn in particular supporting him through this and all week. What a big win. I'm just so impressed with his demeanor out there. The quiet intensity from Jamie Cooey. He ain't so bad. A three and one record handing <laughs> Brad Gushu the loss. Seven five the final. Uh, did it stick around? Unbelievable. As we check now the standings, Gushu falls to two and two. Remember, Jamie Cooey now has that head to head win, and that is massive at the end of the week. You see McEwen wearing those Saskatchewan colors, perfect as well, 3-0. and oh, Top three from each side will qualify. Slichinski, that loss, drops to 2-1. Yeah. and one. On the other side is Botcher Carruthers. They're both perfect yeah. at 3-0.
Groundhog Day. Get out of here. A uh, record setting day, historic moment. We'll step aside for Regina. What a day for Jamie Cooey. The 2024 Montana's Briar is proudly presented by Montana's Barbecue and Bar, Canada's home for barbecue. By Kruger Products, the softest and strongest supporters for over 40 years. By BKT Tires, growing together. And by PointsBet, the official sports gaming partner of Curling Canada. A massive win over Team Canada, and of course, some time to sign some autographs. Wonderful fans, great support here in Regina. And what a start, a three and one record. His best start ever, and his best start since back in 2012. And Team Canada, Brad Gushu. Gracious, even in a loss. Time for the fans, some autographs. As he falls to two and two in Regina this week. So just a reminder, our next matchup is Trevor Bonneau, two and one record Northern Ontario here for the first time. Brendan Botcher, the Briar champion from back in Calgary, the bubble in 2021. He's three and oh, that's later today at 3 p.m. Eastern time as myself, Russ Cathy, have you covered right here on TSN. Congratulations to Jamie Cooey and his team out of the North, the first time ever knocking off Team Canada improving to three and one. On behalf of our entire hardworking crew here in Regina, we thank you for watching our Montana's Briar coverage, and we'll see you later on this afternoon from Regina inside the Brand Center.